<laughs> How to pick up girl 101. Step one, walk over to girl. Step two, pick her up. <laughs> Shake her. Step three, run. <laughs> hey, girl. A long time ago, in a Twitch stream, far, far away. Episode 1, Pokemon H. Salty DK Dan has returned to his home planet of Twitch.com in an attempt to stream and beat a hacked version of Pokemon Red and Blue called Pokemon H. It is very funny because all the Pokemon and text have been removed and replaced with H. Isn't that funny, guys? Imagine watching a two-hour video that chronicles the events of that playthrough. Anyway, please enjoy this absolute descent into madness. So, uh... Playing this. H! Welcome to Pokemon H version. I'm so excited about this. You have no idea. Let me let me quickly explain. One of my viewers, regular boys, his name is LolXD, and uh, he made this ROM hack that I've been dying to play ever since I first saw it. I believe Joel streamed this. That's okay because Joel didn't beat it. Joel just played it for five minutes. He gave up. All right. Anyway, we're gonna end it now. Pokemon H edition. Stupid little gag. It was great for ten minutes. We're not gonna continue this. Ugh. I'm gonna beat it because that's what we do here on Salty DK Dan. We beat video games. H H H H H H H H H H H H H Or maybe is it? Okay, so right off the bat, the the sprites are reversed. I'll just moonwalk everywhere. Even the. The speech bubble is H. I was telling my friends about this. I was like, guys, what would you think if I tried to complete this entire game on stream? And they were like, you're gonna run out of stuff to make commentary on within 10 minutes. And I said, nay, I'm playing funny video game. So uh, this is H, uh, the H Pokemon. Uh, this is also H. And this one is H. Uh, the H Pokemon. So I'm thinking I'm probably gonna go with H. Feel free to make your comments in the chat, but like, I think H is probably the best one. You're a fucking moron. The current meta is focused entirely on H, not H. Fuck! Shit, okay, should I restart? If it's focused around H, then I should have probably picked H. Yes, reset. Hard reset. Okay. Yeah, let, let's reset. I gotta make sure that I get the right one. If you pick H again, you're fucked. Oh my god. Also, I'm Luigi. I, I think I forgot to, to comment on that. I'm Luigi. Well, I have an H on my head, so I'm- I'm who? Luigi. We know the meta now, so like, I'll just pick H and we'll be fine. Salty, I swear to God, if you pick the wrong H. No, wrong? I'm getting wrong. Well, which which H is best for the meta though? Jesus, we can't explain this any simpler. Dude, I'm trying my best because I thought H was the best, but like, we're going with H. Wait a second, that's not an H. Okay, we gotta reset. I'm sorry, that's just not an H. I'm just gonna go with H, okay? You guys keep leading me astray. I, I keep thinking that it's an H, but it's not an H. Oh, you know what would be really funny for a name? Okay, check this out. H, 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 backslash, backslash, exclamation point, question mark. My God, that is going to be so fucking funny to read every time. Oh my God. Fucking hysterical, dude. Jesus. Having people say H, 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 backslash, backslash, uh, exclamation point, question mark. This is fucking hilarious, dude. Oh, fuck. H, H, H. H, 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 H. Fuck, man. Fuck. Um, H? Ah, oh, fuck! Just use H again. No, 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 not H. Not H, come on, come on. No! Fuck! Oh my god! My first fucking H battle! And that shit happens! Pretty good way to play the game, honestly. Because reading other letters is kind of tiring, but when everything's just H, you just kind of get stuff done a lot quicker. Okay, the game, uh, crashed? <laughs> <laughs> All right, just want to make sure not to run into any H's. Shit! Fuck! Ah, oh, shit! Okay, I'm not prepped for this. Hey, chat, if you want to type anything, can you just type it in H's? Because I can't read anything that's not in H, so... This is everybody telling me to H. Guys, I'm trying to H. Yeah, no, I, I don't think I can... Yeah. No, yeah, no, I, you know, I tried that. This joke won't get old. It definitely won't. And now we are off on our H journey. First, I just want to make sure to H. 
But yeah, no, uh, the amazing world of ROM hacks, huh? You can make anything that you want in Pokemon. You can make it so that your mother loves you. I thought about doing a Nuzlocke in this, but then I realized that would probably go horribly wrong, like, really fast. So I just decided against it. Fuck. Which of these are the Pokeballs? This has the same amount of H's as Pokeball, so I'm assuming that this is a Pokeball? <laughs> okay. I'm hoping that that's a Pokeball. All right, let's do it. Go, H! H! Use H! Oh, wait, shit, I forgot health. Uh, uh, let's just go for the H. Go! Yes! Okay, th that's the Pokeball. Okay. Fuck! Go catch it! Come on! Come on! Come on! Fuck! 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 Shit. I wish I knew what level my H was at. That would be really useful to know. Help Salty, my mother just turned into an H. Dude, celebrate. It's not every day that your mom turns into a giant letter. Maybe put her next to a bunch of other letters and like make a word. H. Is this like a physical attack? I would really like that. Oh, it's Leech Seed. So I got Bulbasaur H. Wait, that's actually really good because the first gym is Rock Types. Or H Types. My, my bad. This really is peak gaming. In 2019, I bet that we'll have flying cars and the cure to major illnesses. And then you just post this. So, I guess I should talk about something that's not related to H, just to spice things up. See, what's interesting about this is now, it's a joke ROM hack, but it's actually created a really unique sort of gameplay for Pokemon. Because I've played Pokemon Red and Pokemon Fire Red so many goddamn times that I've almost memorized certain trainer interactions and Pokemon types that they have. So now you have to play the game without knowing what Pokemon you're fighting against and what advantage your Pokemon has against their Pokemon. Shut up, Salty, you nerd. No, you shut up! There was legitimately people in elementary school that would be like, Oh, you still watch cartoons? Like, yeah, bro, I'm fucking seven. The fuck, am I, the fuck are you watching? Yeah, I just binged watched a couple of pornos with my dad. It was pretty epic, you know? Bro, that reminds me. I played Yu-Gi-Oh! a lot when I was a kid. I had one of those fancy schmancy Egyptian god cards, and some motherfucker just went to the teacher and said that I stole them from him. Meanwhile, I stole nothing. I was being framed, and the teacher didn't believe me. They were like, excuse me, Bill over here said that you stole that card from him. And I'm like, no, I didn't. I got this in the trading card pack. And he's like, well, I don't believe you. Hand it over. And she fucking took my Egyptian god card and gave it to Bill. That was my obelisk, the tormentor. You're a bitch. You gotta kill Bill. Yeah, Bill, if you're listening to this, I challenge you to a battle to the death. You win, I hurl myself off the nearest cliff. But if I win, you give me my Egyptian god card back. He probably still has it. Probably says, yeah, I took this. I'm a dick. What the fuck? It's an H. That was beautiful. Salty, can you do an ASMR of Wario and Waluigi having a political debate? Wah! I need free healthcare! Obamacare was a mistake! You're turning into Skeletor? No, it's- it's Waluigi. Look, like- Wah, Waluigi! I this is Skeletor! It's a- it's a totally different voice. What are you talking about? How much you wanna bet we're gonna get to a point in this ROM hack where they stop being H's because the creator was just like, Nah, I don't wanna- uh, this is just a joke hack. I don't wanna do it all the way through. Hey guys, Q&A. Send me your questions and I might answer them. Totally not doing this to have things to talk about because I'm running out. Salty, what is your favorite letter? H, of course! Why don't you care for Captain Marvel? Okay, unlike a lot of people, I actually like the Captain Marvel movie. I thought it was okay. I didn't think it was like the greatest thing ever, but like I thought it was okay. Maybe the sequel will be better. I have faith that it'll find its footing. The next best thing for me I think right now is Doctor Strange. I really like Doctor Strange. What about Sans Undertale? Oh yeah, no, him in the MCU I'm really excited about. Like I'm really glad that Toby Fox actually like was okay with that deal. I wish that a <laughs> I wish that the trainer made a cartoon sound effect every time you move. Like like that one that one sound effect from uh the Flintstones. Like whenever they would run or like whenever like they would like use a machine it would be like I can't make that noise with my mouth, but you know what I'm saying. Chat, what are your favorite MCU movies? I'm I'm curious to see if there's like any like big ones that people like a lot. Like overall MCU is probably just Infinity War. I know how dumb that sounds. It's like, oh, it's a big crossover movie. Of course you like it. But like, yeah, it's fucking cool. I think Infinity War is definitely better than Endgame in terms of pacing. I don't know. It's just a lot funner. <laughs> funner is not a word. You're a dumb bitch idiot. All right. I, I can accept that. <laughs> like, I would just submit to that. That's just the type of person I am. Like, you're a dumb, stupid, fucking whore idiot. 
All right, I sure am. I don't watch superhero movies, but I really like Black Panther. Yeah, I remember my friend Pasty really liked Black Panther. I really liked the action in Black Panther, but I didn't like the political aspect. I think it dragged in some places. Oh wait, shit. I mean, I mean, I really like Black Panther. I'm not, I'm not racist. Uh, uh, fuck. Fuck, don't clip this. But yeah, no, dude, Michael B. Jordan, one of the best villains in the MCU. Right up there with Thanos. Like, I'm not even joking. He's just so fucking fun to watch. You know, the way that the sprite is positioned, it looks like Brock has some really crazy hair going on up there. Because it's like in juxtaposed in front of The Rock. Oh, speaking of The Rock, Dwayne The Rock Johnson got married. And I'm really sad about it because that means I can't marry him. Fuck! My favorite MCU movie is probably Despicable Me. Liked how it was the first MCU where the main character is a villain instead of a hero. No, actually, I'm the same way. Like, the moment they started teasing Gru joining the universe, I was freaking out. I'm such, like, a big Despicable Me fan. So, like, when that happened, I was like, whoa, my god. <gasps> H is evolving! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No fucking way! Holy shit! Guys, it fucking became another H! What the fuck, dude? That's crazy! I was not expecting this to happen! Hanging out with me is like hanging out with, like, Obama. I sit around and I talk about how great Obamacare is. It's epic, as the kids say. Michelle, get in here! Tell the kids about Obamacare! Yeah, that's right! It's me, Obama. I'm here on Twitch. Talk to you about Obamacare while I'm playing this game about funny H characters. Fuck, I forgot my last name. Michelle, what is my last name? I know my first name's Obama, but what's the last name? Shit. I like these little funny H guys. The way they pat their hands on your hips makes you look like Family Guy. Uh, yeah, I love them. Michelle, get in here. The H is doing the funny Family Guy pose. But you're a very funny internet man. No, I'm not. Have you watched these streams? I started this H Let's Play by saying H for fucking 30 minutes. Oh my god, wait. Is this stream cringe? Am I going to lose subscriber? Fuck, man. Can internet clout pay my bills? If you have enough of it, you can get sponsors. Speaking of sponsors, I just want to take a quick second to talk about Raid Shadow Legends. Raid Shadow Legends is a new mobile-based RPG that is insanely crazy cool. Like, look at these graphics. Look how high def these characters are. Wow. This on a mobile game? That's epic. If you use my download code, www.raidshadowlegends.com slash saltydk, fuck you, then you get 30% off your clout point. Hey, would you guys get mad if I actually took a sponsorship by Raid Shadow Legends? I'm asking for a friend. Speaking of which, this video is uh, sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. <laughs> Can clout bring my wife back from the grave? Uh, no. Or... You know, maybe. I haven't tried to revive anybody from the dead yet, but like maybe if I like stand above one of my friend's gravestones in the future and make a funny tweet, they might be revived. Hey guys, do you think I could use my internet clout to get Mark to record a video of him offering me specifically chalky milk? You know, if this ends up actually getting made into a highlight video where I just beat the entire game, would that even make for a good video? <laughs> Imagine I waste a week in my weekly upload schedule to upload my full playthrough of this. Why is that H floating there? What? Why is the H floating there? I think it's a good second channel video. Nah, this is going on main channel. I don't fucking care. I don't give a shit. This is the content you people want. You people listen to a video where me and a couple of friends did 47 minutes of Irwin impressions. You're telling me that this isn't good content? Fuck you. This is excellent content. Look how funny the H's are. I'm lolling right now. I am lolled. Like LOL. <laughs> I don't know why, but... <laughs> But seeing the H's just made me laugh. I know that's dumb. I know we are 40 minutes into this game, but it made me laugh. <laughs> JoJo's for cucks. Ban me. All right. Banning you and ban. All right. You are banned. <laughs> he actually banned him. <laughs> I mean, he asked. <laughs> he asked specifically ban me. So I <laughs> he asked me to do it. What? <laughs> What am I supposed to say? No? I gave him what he wanted! <laughs> He's crying because he lost a sub. Bro, I don't care. I got like five subscribers. They love my content. Kakuin, you got banned on my Twitch server. This must be the work of an enemy stand. No, Jotaro, you just have the auto mod on. Uh, nani? Auto mod? It must be some sort of range to stand no jotaro it's just like a computer like it's it's like a moderator that's just made by twitch uh, nani? Stand up. Uh. jotaro you need to fucking calm down <coughs> yara, yara, you're losing views very fast oh no wait i know how to get them back hey guys it's me ninja and i'm playing fortnite watch the view counter go up after i said that <laughs> they won't even fucking know ninjas on mixer fuck uh 
Uh, hey guys, it's me, Joel from Vine Sauce. Granddad! Hey guys, it's me, Vinny. I am from New York. Yes, yes, we got one more viewer. Yes, yes, it's working. Yes, guys, it's me, Vinny. I'm trapped in this stream, and the only way that you can save me is by subscribing. <laughs> Hey, Vinny, how can you be here when you're streaming right now? It's it's a faker, guys. It's really me, Vinny, from New York. You want me to prove it? Okay. Spoon! That's how you know it's me. It's me, Vinny. I love video games. <laughs> the, the viewers jumped when I started impersonating Vinny. <laughs> Vinny saved you. He did, but but at what cost? A lot of people were commenting on my uh, playthrough of Nicktoons Freeze Frame Frenzy. They were like, why the fuck can he do such good impressions of the Spongebob characters? And I don't fucking know. I think I'm just cursed. I think when I was born, a witch put a curse on me to do like really obscure impressions of fucking characters. What do I do if I get banned? I don't know, die? <laughs> Local streamer Salty DK Dan tells chat members to die. No, I just advise them that they would die if I banned them. If I end up actually making this into a video, it's gonna really suck to hand this off to one of my editors. Hey, uh, whoever's editing this right now, uh, say hi. Hi! Put some text on the screen and say oh, hi. Oh, sorry. Okay, so editor, what's your favorite color? Ah, I like that color a lot, actually. Uh, my favorite color is red. Okay, so now can you like record footage of you dabbing and put that on screen? Okay, great. Chat, what else can I get the editor to do? Editor, uh, zoom in on H. Now zoom out. Now uh, put a picture of Gordon Freeman on screen, but put it on the bottom left and have it like get bigger and bigger slowly throughout the video. And just keep it there like the entire time. Okay, and now can you put uh, a face cam of Bernie Sanders playing on Twitch on the top right of the screen? You know what, editor, just do whatever you want. So, uh, wanna watch a Vine compilation? You know what, never mind. You need to do the whip and nay-nay. That, that's, that's the specific thing you need to do. The whip and the nay-nay when I ask you to. Because if you don't, I'm not paying you. I'm sorry, that's just how it works. Cut all this extra stuff out. Cut me in saying right here, I'm really cool, this is awesome. And leave that, like put that as a clip in the video. Okay, excellent. Yeah, wait, just think about it. Editor, you're getting paid to whip and nene. Is this not your dream job? <laughs> and that's when you put on text on screen that says yes or no. I care about my editors. The people that help me with, with highlight videos, I appreciate you. And I like to make editing fun so it's a little choose your own adventure. You get to put in your own responses, isn't that creative? And sure, maybe the visuals are a little bit monotone because it's just a bunch of black and white H's, but you can have fun with it, you know? This is just for you. Salty DK Dan, say a funny number. Uh, like, t <laughs> I know a funny number. T -t -t 21. <laughs> you have forfeited your tongue. Fool, my tongue was never there. <laughs> Idiot. Fucker. Bitch. It's two penises. <laughs> two penises. <laughs> now that's a clip. Two penises. Me just laughing at myself for saying two penises with no context. I'm proud to announce Penis 2, the sequel to Penis, <laughs> is now here. Do they sell iPhone cases, but like for penises? Because like, what if I, what if I drop my penis and then break it? I can't, I can't say these stupid things without laughing. I don't have a warranty on my dick. I need a case. What the fuck? Penis armor. <laughs> Yeah, it's no big deal, but my dick kind of has plus three defense stats. Guys, how the fuck do you do I level up my penis? <laughs> That's a good question. Wait a second. What is this? Hello? What the fuck? What the fuck is this? This is blowing my mind right now. Is that an eye? Holy shit. <laughs> this is the most cursed shit I have ever seen. I can't catch it. This is a trainer battle. If you ever want to initiate a conversation with somebody, use this screen cap because it just spells hi. 
<laughs> Hi. I don't want to kill it because I feel like I'm killing an endangered species. I'm probably like the first fucking person to find this shit. <laughs> like, what the fuck? You know what I feel like? I feel like an explorer right now. I feel like I've just discovered a new species of animal. <laughs> Clearly, the trainer found it first. Okay, fine. We might need to establish some boundaries here. The most interesting thing to happen in this stupid game was an eye. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, chat's right. The most interesting thing to happen in this entire stream was to see a fucking eye. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Maybe if you're lucky enough, you'll be able to find a J in my dreams. Maybe that's what the legendary Pokemon are. Maybe they're just like different letters. What if Mewtwo is just a massive cock? I'd love it. How much you want to bet the creator just changed one of the Pokemon to an I? Just to like give you hope that there's like more letters. <laughs> like we're gonna get to the Elite Four and it's still gonna be H's. <laughs> God, I live a sad existence. Salty is definitely going to go completely insane before he reaches the Elite Four. <sighs> yep. What if the champ has a reverse H? Oh dear fucking lord. This game is slowly degrading our humor so that we just laugh at letters. <laughs> I like the idea that this is becoming so mind-numbing that it is altering my state of mind to laugh at fucking letters. And you know what? It's working. I'm laughing like a complete fuckhead. You know, I haven't even commented on the fact that the way that the H's are posed and the fact that they have like mittens. Like, are those their bare hands or do they, do they all have like gloves? Do you ever wonder why we're always like... Wearing gloves? But hey, that's just a theory. An H theory. Thanks for watching. I want to kill myself. Less than one badge in, and I'm already sick of seeing the letter H. My god. If I run into one more fucking H, I'm going to lose my shit. Are you fucking kidding me? H. 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 Oh, for crying out H. loud. Why didn't you buy repels? Because I don't know what the repels are. Look at my fucking bag. Can you tell what any of these fucking items are? I can't. I don't know what this is. That was an escape rope. That was a fucking escape rope. And I was near the place I needed to go to get out of the cave. That was an escape rope. I'm a goddamn idiot. I don't even know what level my Pokemon is. For all I know, maybe H is actually a level. Maybe I've just glitched the game so that every level is H. My fucking God. Is that an H? Wait, is that an H? Fuck, it's an H. Every time I type the letter H, I'm just gonna be reminded of this stream. How do I know that that's the potion? How the fuck can my brain like process that? What the fuck? Fuck! This game is conditioning me to do weird shit. It's not the fact that they're H's. That's not the thing that's like fucking me up right now. It's the fact that I keep running into them over and over and over again. Like right now. There it is. <laughs> there he is. My god, there's so many fucking H's. I'm gonna scream. <laughs> Somebody asked me if I had to choose between Matt and Ryan of Super Mega for one to protect me and then the other one would try to kill me, who would you pick? I feel like Ryan, I think the more powerful one, Matt has range, but Ryan has like sheer power and I think he could take a couple of blows. So I'm going to pick Ryan to attack and defend me. So then Matt will have to come after me. And I, I think, I think I'm fine. Ryan will protect me. Ryan is powerful. So if I have the Bulbasaur H, then my rival has the Charmander H. And at this point, they probably have a Charmander. Million H, which means that I would need to grind insanely to be able to beat them, or just really, really lucky. Dear Lord, he has so many H's. Oh my god. Holy shit, I took that guy on like one hit. Fuck, man. Holy shit. What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. Holy shit, I'm really powerful. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at this shit. Look at this! One shot! Oh my god! What H level are you? Bro, I don't know! I don't know! That's the best part! Jesus Christ! I beat this motherfucker in one try! And he walks it off. And my H got really strong really quick. Gamer gamer mode activate. What what the fuck? What okay. I need an explanation. 
I need an explanation right fucking now. So I type in Pokemon on Twitter. The second result is Ricky. The second fucking result is Ricky. Why? Is this a popular gift that people use? Who would use this? Who the fuck would use this? Did the moon landing really happen? Well, I got some bad news. Yes, it did. But because they landed on the moon, it actually knocked it out of orbit. So now, very, very slowly, the moon is hurtling towards the Earth. But once it impacts, we fucking dead. We all fucking dead. Guys, who do you think would win in a fist fight? Mark Zuckerberg or Bill Gates? I'm thinking that the Zuck could probably strangle Bill Gates to death. I mean, like, more powerful than Bill Gates. Let's be real. Like, he would wrap his fingers around Bill Gates' neck and just squeeze until he's dead. Bill Gates is more powerful. Don't ignore me. You keep linking some- uh, Pasty, why are you linking- What are you linking in chat? <laughs> Pasty, what is this video? What- What is this video, Pasty? Leap over a chair from a standing position. It depends on the size of the chair. Uh, I'll cheat a little bit. <laughs> yes! Pasty, why? Oh, hey, look, it's Germa. Would you guys mind if we just watch a Germa video real quick? Can we watch Scott the Waz after? Yeah, sure. Try Thunder for a clean machine. Vroom, vroom! No, we're not doing this. Anyway, so Salty, have you accepted Garfield as your immortal god that will rain terror down on us mere mortals? H! Salty, what is this? Hell? H. Hell. Hell has an H in it. Oh my god, I know what the H stands for now. When I was little, I loved Thomas the Tank Engine. Like, a lot. Thomas was my shit. I had a train set downstairs that I would constantly switch out with different parts and make new little maps. Yeah, that was my shit. And then one day, I got to see a life-size Thomas the Tank Engine, and my small little pea brain just exploded. I was like, oh my god, it's real, Thomas! Oh! And I just died. How many episodes of Thomas traumatized you? Uh, no. None? There's a Thomas the Tank Engine film, and there's a scene where one of the human characters is asleep, and the evil train bursts through the giant brick wall, and he's like, Oh, I'm an evil train. Tell Thomas to meet me at at, uh, train headquarters and I'll battle you. Salty, did you want to fuck the girl train? Well, okay, to be honest, let's be real here. The girl train from the Thomas the Tank Engine movie, she was pretty hot. You know, for a train, let's be real. For a train, she was not a bad looker. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. No, they hated Jesus for he spoke the truth. Chad, I'm about to blow your mind. Thomas Tank Engine movie girl train. You know, it's not always that I regret things that I say, but I think I might regret what I said. To be honest, I had a different image in mind when I was talking about the, the girl train. This is a little bit awkward. I mean, like, if we're talking body, she's a looker. Look at that caboose. Let's just pretend that this part of the stream didn't happen. Derek, please go back to H, you're scaring the chat. Yeah, I'm just gonna ignore that before I put my foot in my mouth about liking trains a little too much. We should just dedicate a portion of the stream to rating every train in Thomas the Tank Engine. From, like, ugliness to hotness. There's some lookers. Conductor is thick, though. Yo, can we talk about Conductor? Can we talk about Conductor real quick? Mr. Conductor? Y'all know if you know Thomas the Tank Engine, you know Sir Topham Hat. It's this guy. According to what I'm seeing on the wiki, his name is The Fat Controller. The Fat Controller. He controls the fat. Just call me The Fat Controller. You know who else is The Fat Controller? My mom! Salty, look up the Train Boy 54 theme song. I dare you. You know what? You know what? Bet. What's the Train Boy 54 theme song? <laughs> okay, what the fuck is this? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what the fuck is this? He's Phineas and Ferb's best friend, you know. What the fuck well, is the this? Will tell you so. <laughs> he helps Phineas and Ferb This is three minutes long. No fucking way this is actually three minutes. There's there's gotta be like there's gotta be something else. Never loses. Oh my god, it's three minutes long. My god. <laughs> Please rise for the national anthem. XXX Tentacion really snapped with this track. I'm gonna be real with y'all. This is getting kinda hard to watch. So I suggest that uh that we slow it down by 0 0.5. <laughs> Oh my god, this makes it so much worse. Train with guitar? <laughs> but 
how does he play it? Out of all of the things in this video, this is the thing that I choose to focus on. Train Guitar Boy. Arrow, stop playing Sonic Mania for two goddamn seconds. I'm trying to talk about Train Boy 54. Oh, hey, Caillou donated $3 and gave me the Brickwall Thomas movie clip. You've just added a browser source. Wow. Yeah, no, this is the right one. This scene gave me nightmares. So who dropped the ball? Where do you get that ball? Wait a second, is that fucking... That's fucking Alec Baldwin. Alec Baldwin was in the Thomas the Tank Engine film? All right, Pinchy, my little bucket of badness. Look at this man. You can't catch me, Diesel. The magic whistle isn't working. Run, Alec Baldwin, run! That's right, it's sugar, Diesel, you stupid fucking idiot. <laughs> what was that? What was that face? What was that face Thomas made? <sighs> he couldn't hit his jewel. Fuck you. You get the point. The guy with the big pinchy made me scared. It was terrifying, man. For for a child? That shit scared the shit out of me. It made me go, ah! Bro, what is happening? What is this? I can just jump on houses now? How did you meet Mikey? Oh, my friend Mikey. Okay, this isn't really much of a funny story or a sad story. It's kind of like, I guess, a cute story. Me and Mikey met in high school. We were both in the play because we were both interested in the play and we both had lead roles. For whatever reason, everybody in the cast was needed except for me and Mikey. So me and Mikey just kind of sat together off to the side and I had always saw Mikey as like a sort of jock type, but uh, he's anything but a jock type like when when he was in high school he, he was pretty ripped i still think he's pretty ripped he says he's not but like he, he's way more ripped than i am what was the play it was beauty and the beast uh i played maurice so i played bell's father and he played lefou i don't know what happened mikey i think just started talking to me and we just found common interests in like video games and stuff and that's how i met mikey and then from that point on we were just friends just as easy as that really you know just just again just to reiterate i want to let you guys know things do get better my life ain't perfect right Right now but i know from experience that things do get better i can guarantee that things will always get better because i've been there too trust me my life was not that good when i was a kid but look at me now now i'm funny internet man with funny voice and funny friends and while my life still is not perfect by any means i feel like i'm at a pretty good place right now i feel pretty content and though sometimes i do get sad it doesn't affect me as much as that it would if i was in high school because i know that things will get better make a funny now or i get sad uh. Oh, S Sans Undertale! Oh! Oh! Ugh, ugh, Th this water tastes like stupid. <laughs> Why did that make me laugh? Oh my god, my sense of humor is deteriorating. This water tastes like stupid, and then I lose my shit. My brain just split in half on that comment. This water tastes like stupid. <laughs> That's the sound of my brain just melting. Can I get your number, Salty? Yeah, uh, it's five. Hello? 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 Yes. Yes. Yes! <laughs> we in it, gamers. How's it going, Mal? It's going pretty good. Just enjoying your stream, having a nice time. Cool. <laughs> so do you like video games? I enjoy video game. That's cool. I hope you're ready for intelligent conversation. I am absolutely ready for a wonderful intelligent conversation. Just like the ones you find in the Salty DK Dan server. <laughs> How dare you promote the server? Yeah, what are you gonna do about it? Gonna cry? Piss your pants, maybe? <laughs> maybe shit and come. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what it's like to be Adam Sandler. Absolutely wild, I'm guessing. A mutual of mine who I used to work on videos with. He, he was at an ice cream store and he turned around and Adam Sandler was just sitting with his daughter eating ice cream and he like snuck a pic. Adam looks really depressed <laughs> and just sad. It's like my favorite image, but my God, in his natural state, Adam just looks so sad. Saddam Sandler. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> Wonderful. Okay, guys, time for an AMA. I'm taking over the stream. Everybody ask Mal questions. Like, what's Mal's favorite color? I like magenta because it's like pink, but it's screaming. What's Mal's favorite dog? I like Tibetan Mastiffs or Tibetan. Is that how I pronounce it? Like Tibetan monks? I don't know. <laughs> it's the name of the dog. They're just really big, fluffy dogs that could like murder a bear. Yeah, this is a good question. Mal, do you like to drink beverages? I enjoy beverages a lot. Beverages are good. What is your favorite beverage? <laughs> what is your favorite <laughs> beverage? <laughs> Mine is water. Mine is apple juice with cranberry. Oh, that is a good beverage. I what do I think of the girl train from the Thomas's Hank Engine movie? Uh, she's pretty hot. Yeah, I think we're all in agreement here. There's no discrepancy. <laughs> Salty is SCP. What? I am not three letters. Sans is so funny to me. I really do enjoy, enjoy Sans as a meme a lot. It's just so funny and ironic how people see Sans as like some kind of like hot ass sex icon. When in reality, he's like a lazy son of a bitch that has no drive for life. Masks everything with humor because he's scared of the existential like the multiverse they're in and shit like that. I like the idea that Sans is viewed as a sex icon to you. <laughs> Who views Sans as a sex icon? A lot of people. I don't know who you haven't been. I don't know if you've been in the tags that often, Derek, but a lot of people see Sans Whoa. and they go, absolute legend. Look, show me that glow stick. Do you know that image where it's the two Sanses <laughs> and they're on the leash and they're like, please, kid, we've been good. We've been good. Please, kid, we've been good. I like how no matter what fictional character exists, the internet will somehow fetishize them. Yeah, it's a thing. Like, I could literally make a character that's named Bricky the Brick, and he's a brick, mm -hmm. and the internet would be like, oh, so hot. Don't Lumps do that. They're, corners. They're, going to, they're going to set them off. Oh, <laughs> my God. I love his corners. <laughs> Honestly, though, they're probably going to take it literally and just draw a brick, so I think you're fine. Is it possible to put a dick on a brick? <laughs> I mean, it rhymes, so it has to be possible. New and improved. Dick on a brick. Buy one today. Only nineteen ninety nine. It does sound like one of those, <laughs> one of those things you'd see advertised on a children's network, except it's extremely vulgar. No. <laughs> Slap a dick on a brick. Dick on a brick. Buy a dick on a brick. Dick on a brick. I like bricks. I like dicks. Slap them together. Get dick on a brick. I hate how good you are at this. But yeah, no, there's a lot of really bizarre children's like board games that have like weird peripherals like the toilet. I want to just come up with my own children's game where it's like a tiny oven and you have to put like a, a dog inside it. <laughs> hey kids, do you like your dog? Yeah. Well, what if we put your dog in an oven? What? Oh, no. I don't like that. Well, too bad. We made it into a board game. Dog in the oven. Put your dog in the oven. It'll be real cool. Put your dog in the oven. It'll be radical. I ran out of rhymes. I don't know what to say. Dog's in the oven and it's okay. I did it. Put the dog in the oven and you win. Dog in the oven. Batteries not included. <laughs> <laughs> JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Phantom Blood Episode <laughs> 1. <laughs> I hate how accurate that is. Now comes with real working oven. Now comes with real dog. <laughs> <laughs> well, besides this, what was your favorite? What was your favorite board game when you were younger? Probably Operation. It's a classic. Put the dog in the oven. It'll be real cool. <laughs> well, <laughs> my, my, my board game was Candyland. That shit slap. Oh man, I love Candyland. I'm honestly shocked that you know the the candy cane guy in the candy cane forest. Yeah. What are you gonna say? Do you think that anybody fetishized that guy? No. I feel like I Straight feel up. like people must have. Straight up, I had a crush on that candy cane guy. Okay, point taken. <laughs> like, but but not to like a fetishizing standard. It was kind of like a. Oh, he's kind of cute. I guess just at the base, I was just wondering, like, do, do you think, like, if he were to come out nowadays, like, he would have a similar following to, like, the Onceler. Yeah, I was on just Tumblr. thinking. That. Okay, chat, I need your opinion. How hot is this guy? Uh, this is his original uh, design. What, yeah, what Young Me had a crush on that. You had a crush on that? Yeah. Young me. He's still kind of cute now, but not. I, I'm not as crushy as I was when I was a kid. Okay, so now compare this design with whatever the fuck this is. They turned him into baby. Look at his eyes. What he has no eyebrows. That's not all. The new design isn't correct. What are you talking about? New, new design. I could have sworn there was a new design where he was kind of like hotter or something. Not this baby Mr. Mime. What did they do? Oh my god. God, he had such a good design and they just destroyed it. <laughs> like, he's like a little candy cane lumberjack guy. He looks cute. And then they were like, no, he's got to be a fucking JoJo character. 
<laughs> the, the, the little candy cane thing in the back of the stand. Yeah, what, what is that little candy cane boy? I think he shits those things out. Hmm. Compared to body ratio, I can see those things see. coming out of his ass. I mean, I don't blame you. I've seen, I've seen stuff. I believe it. Mal, what does that mean? Don't worry about it. Mal? <laughs> Shut up. You like Mal, trades. You Don't worry can't about come on stream and say things like this. You have said worse. I mean, yeah. true. I did have an entire moment where I was talking about fucking trains. <laughs> Dude, there's a Candyland character named <laughs> Grandma Nut. Yeah, there is. She's thick. <laughs> <laughs> Come over here, dearie. It's me, Grandma Nut. <laughs> Nut. 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 You kind of look like Shrek, though, and that makes me LOLXD. <laughs> <laughs> If I ever archive this VOD, no one will understand what we're laughing at. Somebody in chat fucking <laughs> just used an emote of a World of Warcraft character and commented on how it looks like Shrek and it makes them laugh. <laughs> I don't know why I found that so funny. I think I've had enough. I'm gonna go watch some Vine Sauce for now. Later, Salty. Understandable. Go watch Later. better content. But who the fuck is Salty? Yeah, who is that? It's me. Who? who are you? Me. Hi, it's nice to meet you. Stop yelling at me. No. <laughs> this type of talk can only happen at 1 a.m. It's the best kind of talk to me, honestly. You never know what's gonna happen next. Yeah, I could start singing. You could. I emoji. <coughs> Absolutely wonderful. That was uh, that was my new like song. Shit's lit. Ah, hey, real clunk in chat just turned 20. You know what that means? Time to start watching big boy content. Ah, uh, yeah. You're no longer 12 years old. Now you have to stop watching a uh, funny ninja Fortnite guy, <laughs> and you have to start watching the presidential debates. <laughs> Somebody in chat. Hmm? I, I don't know why this is killing me. <laughs> they said going to court is funny. I went there and the judge had funny hair. <laughs> My God. <laughs> Let's have a Family Guy impression contest. Lois Griffin. Okay. Peter. <laughs> I I feel like we're thinking of different characters. <laughs> I don't know, it sounds pretty right to me. What about Peter Griffin? What does he sound like? Hi, Lois. We're in Undertale. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why the Megamind memes have been blowing up recently, but I appreciate it a lot. Yeah, it's well deserved. Train six. Wonderful. Yeah, wonderful comment. Thank you. You guys have the best commentary. It's really <laughs> great. I really <laughs> Oh, God. Hey, Salty, can you sing Shark Tale? That's like an hour long film. That's not a song. <laughs> Do you think the bugs are real? No. This should be. That would be epic. <laughs> what What if I wrote the letter H in the stream chat? Wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> that would be absolutely hilarious, and I'd probably die laughing. Salty, when you talk to a girl, <laughs> do you have WarioWare Smooth Moves? Yeah, I always got a copy of it in my pocket. <laughs> Is that WarioWare <laughs> Smooth Moves for the Wii in your pocket, or are you just happy to see me? Mm. <laughs> no, it's just WarioWare Smooth Moves for the Wii. Speaking of, would you like to play? How to pick up girl 101. Step one, walk over to girl. Step two, pick her up. <laughs> Shake her. Step three, run. <laughs> Step three, run. <laughs> I just love the idea of somebody being like, hey girl, and then picking her up and shaking her and then running away. Hey girl. Hey girl. <laughs> Gosh. Dad, how do I how do I talk to my crush? Well, son, have you tried shaking her? I haven't. I'll try that. <laughs> Dad, it worked. She's really dizzy and she threw up. Well, son. Great. Bye. You did it. My <laughs> my job here is done. Goodbye, my, son. <laughs> my job here is done. I leave. Dad, where are you going? Back home. But, but, but we're home. No. My house. It's separate. <laughs> <laughs> it's my secret house. Shush, don't tell your mother. <laughs> <laughs> the idea that 
This man's father has his own secret house. He's just gonna leave. Yeah, it's in the backyard. It's in the backyard. It's the shed. Yeah. <laughs> Have you tried shaking your hand? I don't. Okay, I'll try that. Remember. Remember what? I don't know. <laughs> See ya. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I, I like Strange Dad. <laughs> the new character. Hey son, I bought a boat. That's great, Dad. Can we can we go fishing on it? No. All right, bye. <laughs> Fuck you. He just, he just comes in to proclaim stuff and just leaves right now. <laughs> Isn't that funny? <laughs> Chat just figured out that Obama isn't real. Oh, shit. It was all a fabrication. Uh, you and Mal make campaign advertisements to run for president. Okay, we're we're going against each other? Yeah, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go against each other. What's your campaign slogan? Okay, uh, thanks for coming to my election. <laughs> thanks for coming to my elect- SHIT! Instead of kissing babies on the forehead, I'm just gonna like chuck babies against a brick wall. <laughs> That'll make people want to vote for me. I'm gonna have campaign posters that have my head, and it just says on the bottom, VOTE ME AND YOU WILL SQUEE. Mine will be, ooh woo, I'm the president for you. <laughs> Furry president. Yes, that's that would be me. My god. That'd be like a post-apocalyptic scenario. <laughs> <laughs> My fellow Americans. Ooh woo. Imagine a fursuiter getting the nuclear launch codes. Peak comedy. <laughs> peak comedy. We have reached the peak. <laughs> you you have entered the comedy area. <laughs> Mario is funny. He is funny, isn't he? I like his mustache. <laughs> what about his mustache do you like? It's funny. But what What's funny about it? You can't just say something is funny and that makes it funny. <laughs> this funny. isn't 2016 YouTube. <laughs> it has the funny shape. Again. <laughs> now. <laughs> Comedy doesn't work like that. I don't know. Can you prove me wrong? Odds are there's probably somebody in chat that's losing their fucking mind at that comment. <laughs> Like, oh my god, that's so relatable. Mario's <laughs> mustache is funny. Oh, he makes me laugh too. He's, he's a <laughs> fictional plumber. That's so stupid. <laughs> my god, how many H's are there? They're Maybe everywhere in like, my shack. hair, yeah. between my toes. <laughs> Don't say toes. Knows. Don't say toes. You're 12 year olds. They like toes. I've gotten so many DMs about my toes. <laughs> Have I talked about this? I don't think you have, but There's I believe There's like a it. subsection group of people on Twitter that keeps DMing me to ask for toe pics. And just like, I don't know what to say because it's like, haha, funny meme, you're asking for toe pics. But like, what happens if I actually send toe pics to you? Like, how are you going to react? It's like, oh, it'll be funny. I, I ask internet content creator for pictures of his toes. But like, what happens if I actually respond and give you toe pics? Like, what do you think is going to happen? You should you should have them buy your toe pics. If they want to see your toes, they have to pay. Yeah, them. send me $50, I'll give you toe pics. Okay. You know, no, I'm gonna make that a hundred. Okay. Damn. Why are you why you want my toe pics so bad? Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of fetish things, it's funny when the people have like fetishes no, that are no fetishes. good story ever starts with that lead in. Don't worry about it, it's not Speaking that bad. Speaking of fetish stuff, I have a funny it's not story. <laughs> it's not my fetish. Go on. Okay. Being an artist and a person who draws online, you get the weird person every now and then in your DMs. So it'll be like, hey, have you ever uh have you ever drawn Transformation? Yeah, I'm a really big fan of Transformers. Autobots, roll out, you know? <laughs> and they'll, they'll just be like, I'm like, is this a fetish ass? Like, no, it's not. But have you ever drawn a character transforming? <laughs> I'm like, well, I have this werewolf character. I guess they could transform. But can mm. you draw them mid-transformation? Mm. I'm like, mm. Mm. Significant mm. chunks of this stream will be cut. <laughs> <laughs> Editor. Hey, editor, huh? you know the raunchy stuff to cut, right? You're not gonna put in the train fucking, right? Um... Right? Gables, you're not gonna put um... in the train fucking stuff, right? Back to the boys. <laughs> Back to the boys. Dan, they, they hot. They hot. <laughs> oh, goddamn. Mm. You know what? Everybody in this chat's hot. In the Twitch chat. That's, we got 12-year-olds in here. Oh, wait. Okay, never mind. Uh, Y'all are ugly as fuck. <laughs> I'm trying to go to sleep, but I can't because you're both making me laugh every few seconds. Go to sleep, you stupid <laughs> motherfucker! Just click off. We got to Lavender Town, and I heard the music, and I remembered all the creepypastas, and it's 2 a.m., and I was like, Hey, maybe we should stop playing here because it's getting too scary. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. That's really creepy. Remember that one creepypasta where it's like, there's frequencies in the Lavender Town theme that make kids kill themselves? I was really into that creepypasta. Yeah, me too. I was like, is this real? I can't tell. It's almost like I could 
probably Google it and find out results, but, but I, I don't know. I remember a Disney show called Aaron Stone. Oh my god, I remember that show too. I think that came out when I was like in fifth grade. I remember being in art class, one of the people in class talking about how hot Aaron Stone was. And I was like, okay, I'm just trying to make a paper mache head. But yeah, sure, talk about how hot Aaron Stone is. He was hot. Pretty hot. Yeah, there's this other show called Parker Plays where they actually had a YouTuber come in and record stuff. Mm. Parker is actually pretty funny, I would say. It's just weird that Let's Players have shows and they're not like doing something original. It's just them doing Let's Plays. Like if I ever had the opportunity to make a TV show, I would never want to do fucking Let's Plays. But like, I guess yeah. that's all they really do. I would make a show about sock puppets and I would call it Puppetlandia. It would be like Ubi, but they're clothed. It would be like Ubi, but there's a long running story background of every episode about war and love <laughs> it's like the steven universe of hand puppets <laughs> imagine an ubi hand puppet becoming a gay icon i could i'd love to see that twitter moment ubi 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 confirmed gay by showrunner <laughs> fucking icon i would love to see edits of just like it's ubi but like right next to it was like gay icon it's just like the rainbow flag out of all of the characters to have the headcanon that they're gay i think that ubi Ubi deserves it. Ubi. We stan. We stan Ubi, a legend. Sock puppet, new gay icon, so inspiring. <laughs> Bitch, I will do that. I will make my sock puppet characters all gay. <laughs> like, they will enter, like, the leagues of Steven Universe with representation, but they're all, like, just bad sock puppets. <laughs> It could be the new Potter Puppet Pals. <laughs> except they're all gay. Yeah, except they're all gay. And one of them is bi. If you think about it, straight people are extremely limited. But when you're bi or pan, just the world opens up. <laughs> It's like your third eye opens and you're like, I could literally just be in a relationship with anybody. Anyone. The I power. So <laughs> just the emperor from Star Wars. Unlimited power. <laughs> Unlimited romance options. It's like how cis people have their mommies choose their names for them while us Chad trans people get to choose our own names. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a good comment. Absolute chads, I love it. Your stupid mom picked your name, I got to pick my own fucking name. <laughs> fucking dipshit. Ah, fuck. Ah, I don't know what the fuck I just did. I, I just popped my pelvis. How did I do that? Oh, I do that sometimes. I it literally, like, I, I moved my legs and my fucking pelvis just clicked really loud. Yeah, it hurts. <laughs> it doesn't feel good. Like, I'll move and it'll be like, and I'll be like, ah! It doesn't feel good. It felt bad. You ever just, you ever just break your coochie? <laughs> That's kind of what it felt like. <laughs> you just crack your coochie. That's what it is. And then you're like, ah! Coochie crack. Coochie crack. Doctor, is there a diagnosis? Why, yes, you seem to have a broken coochie. Oh no. What can I do about my broken coochie? You can only pray. You have no. two seconds to live. Oh no. Oh, oof. Yeah, that's my final words too. Oof. I'm really gonna like, if I die of old age and I can control what my last words are, I'm gonna say some really stupid shit. I'm gonna be like, the treasure is buried. Ugh. <laughs> That'd be great. <laughs> Follow this, these GPS coordinates. Latitude 3,500 degrees north. Uh. <laughs> Imagine you actually give them a lead and they get to it and they open the box and it's just an okay hand sign. Oh my god, yeah. Where I go like, type this URL into Google Chrome. They type it in and it's just like a gif of a dancing baby. <laughs> That's my final gift to my son and daughter. Cream Jess, Nene, baby. And they both shed a tear while w watching this gif of a <laughs> dancing baby. And they're like, that's dad. <laughs> oh, hey, didn't see you there. Sorry, you you caught me while I was uh while I was watching George of the Jungle then and now. It's actually a pretty good comparison video of actors from George of the Jungle and where they are now. It's pretty cool. Like you don't think that actors age, but they do. They're like actually real people. It's fucking bizarre. I'm back. I'm playing some Pokemon H. I told myself I am physically not allowed to play Pokemon Sword until I beat this. None of which matters because the only thing that matters is that in the meantime, I actually learned how to change the colors of the Game Boy player. So get this, okay? I have the ultimate color palette to play this game with. Yes! Yes! 
Yes! Yeah, piss world! Piss world! How you guys liking this, huh? You have entered the piss dimension. So wait, is the audio okay? Let me, let me see. Ah! 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 That seems okay. That seems okay. <laughs> I'm like echoing! <laughs> I'm like echoing! <laughs> I'm like echoing! <laughs> It's like, like slowly quieter, like slowly quieter, like slowly quieter. Hey, Salty, how's it going? Hey, Salty, how's it going? Oh, it's going great. Thanks for asking. How's it going? Oh, it's going great. Thanks for asking. Yeah, yo, how how are you doing, man? Yeah, yo, how, how are you doing? I, I'm really, I, I I love I love your stuff. I'm a big fan. I, I, I love. I'm a I'm a really big fan. I'm a I'm a really big fan. All right, see you later, man. Yeah, see you later. All right, see you later, man. Yeah, see, yeah, see you guys see later. later. See you guys later. Yeah, see, see you guys later. Yeah, see you later. Yeah, see, see you later. Yeah, see you later. Yeah, see you later. <laughs> man, I, I, I like that guy. I don't know who that was. I, I like that guy a lot. Anyway, welcome back to the piss dimension. Population Urine. I just got here. What what is happening? Welcome, sir, to the Piss Dimension. I'm the Piss Dimension World Governor. My name is Jeff Penis Grabber. If you got a penis, I'm gonna grab it. You can't stop me. Excuse me, Mr. Grabber. That's me, Jeff Penis Grabber. Yeah, you can't grab somebody's penis without their consent. What? Yeah, no, you can't do that. The fuck you mean? I'm the governor of fucking Piss World. I can do whatever I goddamn please. Well, sir, you're not above Piss World law. I don't give a fuck. I am the law. Oh, everybody, it's me, uh, Quiznos. Please go to your local Quiznos to Dubai pizza. Ah! Hey, Salty, why life painful? Well, can't help you there, bud. Just give me one sec. All right, Merry Christmas, everybody! I I can't even see that. I I don't know what that is. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody! Oh shit! Oh shit! It's a ghost H. Fuck! I can't fight this thing. It's haunted. Salty, how do you feel about Half Life, Alex? Okay, so here's how I feel about Half Life. I don't care. I tried to get into Half-Life, I couldn't. I'm sorry. It's super dated now. The first Half-Life is insanely dated, but the second Half-Life is pretty okay. I just wish I had the opportunity to play those games when they first came out. Gamer license revoked. You can't revoke my license. What are you, some, some kind of gamer judge? You gonna take me to gamer court? Kick my gamer ass? Here's the problem that I literally just realized I'm gonna have. In this game, it's mandatory that you need to use Surf to get to Cinnabar Island. How the fuck am I gonna do that? I don't even know if I have water type Pokemon. Can we blacklist the word boomer? Please God. Why? People are asking why. Really? You, you really gonna ask why? Pe people? <laughs> Listen, I'm a fan of calling people boomer too, but God damn, do you guys use it incorrectly? I am not a boomer. I'm a fucking millennial. Okay, boomer. You know what? You know what? Block boomer too. Anything that looks remotely close to boomer. Boomer with two zeros instead of O's. You see, people are finding ways around it, but we'll... Fucking, you know what? No. Anybody that says anything close to OK Boomer, anything close, fucking time them out. Get cursed to the fucking Shadow Realm. OK, buddy. <laughs> Okay, green Mario. You know what? Can we just use that from now on? Instead of okay boomer, can we just call all boomers green Mario? And we can call millennials red Mario. Okay, Q&A. Ask me anything. 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 Except for weird shit. I'm not gonna answer uh, you if you ask me what my mother's credit card information is. I'm sorry. I I'm sorry. I would never. It's five six seven nine four two zero two zero four three two nine four. The expiration date is twelve twenty. The three wacky numbers on the back are seven two four. Favorite JoJo, Josuke. Favorite landlord, uh, my landlord. Ha 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 ha. Favorite hentai. Horton hears a who. Opinion on H. It's my least favorite letter of the alphabet right now. What's your favorite letter? Probably D. For D's nuts. That wasn't even funny. I don't even know why I did- I said that. Favorite religion? <laughs> what a great question. Ah, that, that's such a good question. I think that Scientology is hysterical. Out of all of the religions, Scientology is like the one that sits alone in the corner of the lunchroom and doesn't want to sit with anybody else. Like you offer to sit with them and they're just like, no, I, I don't want to sit with you guys. Least favorite religion? Uh, that'd have to probably be Scientology. Damn, that's edgy. Yeah, you know, uh, if you come to this stream, you get some really edgy humor. Like, what would happen? If... Oh no, fuck. Fuck, no. No! What did I just do? 
No! What did I just do? What move did I just forget? Oh my god. Oh my f Okay, please be a physical move. Please, please. Oh my fucking god, it's solar beam. I am so depressed. I forgot razor leaf for for a move that does no damage. It's pro it's probably growth. It is probably growth. That whoever said that, that's a really good point. What does growth even do? Effects. Growth raises users' attack and special attack by one stage. E oh my god. No! No! Why? I am so mad and upset. And I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna reset. I, I can't. Commit to your damn decisions. I fucked up. I gotta commit to it now. I don't remember there being a way to relearn moves in this game. Oh, fantastic. Good. Good. There's no move tutor in Gen 1. Good. Good! Good! Yes! I love video games! Whoa! Yeah, baby! Whoa! I love this game! Whoa, my god! Oh, don't tell me! I didn't even have to go over here! I... I'm... I'm done. Very, very excited. Very excited about this. Very, very excited. Very excited about this. Okay, I'm assuming that these are all TMs. Now we just need to figure out which one is takedown. I... I have a limited amount of money, so I can't... Mm, teach to first day. What? No fucking way. It, it said it can learn takedown. Oh, no. It should be this one, right? Okay, you know what? I'm just fucked. Do I not have enough money? I swear to God. I don't have enough money. Can I sell? Can I sell my other TM? Take it. I don't want it. Jesus Christ, this is so stressful. Yes? No! I just... I want to cry. I want to cry so much. This is going to go insanely well. Oh good, it's an eye! Go to the mall. On top is a little girl who can give you three different TMs. One is Ice Beam. You can evolve Eevee into Vaporeon and teach it that. Okay, but how do I get the Water Stone? It's on the fourth floor. It is the second to last option. Okay, I know exactly what I'm gonna do now. First, we're gonna get that TM. And then, we're gonna get that Water Stone. Then we're gonna evolve Eevee and give it the other TM from the top of the department store. And then, I will cry. I will cry and die. It's been like this for 20 minutes. Yeah, well, welcome to my fucking world. How do you think I feel about this? Not very good, but I caused this to happen myself. W H, uh, no, W A T E R S T O N E. This is the water stone. There we go. It worked! It totally changed! Eevee, I mean Vaporeon, I need you, please. Hit the ice beam, please! God, please, God, oh God, oh fuck. Yes! Yes! I think Vaporeon might end up becoming the new MVP of the team. This is a grass type gym and Vaporeon is holding their own insanely well. I believe in them. Yes! Believe! Yes! Yes! Please, 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 please hit. Hit the ice beam, please! Come on, you got this Vaporeon! Come on! Please! Hit! No! Let's just use growth real quick. Go. Go. Die. Die! <laughs> My weakest H here to save the day. Me unlearning one of the only moves that Ivysaur knows that does physical damage is probably the dumbest shit I've ever done. Let's just go beat the shit out of Erica. Somebody just joined the stream and they were genuinely curious. Like, how is Salty playing this? Like, how, how does he know which moves are which? I'm playing by the seat of my pants. I have no idea what I'm doing. This is like a test of like, can you beat Pokemon Red and Blue through just button mashing? Instead of calling this Pokemon H, they should have called it Pokemon A because I'm just mashing the A button fucking randomly. I already ran out of PP. I hate it. I hate when I run out of PP. Fuck you. Fuck you. Come on, Vaporeon. Let's destroy everybody in this fucking team. Ice Beam. Kill. Are you kidding me? Are you? Okay. No. Sorry. I'm gonna put Ivysaur back into the PC box because Ivysaur cannot do any damage. And the thing is, is that Ivysaur is too powerful right now to die. If I don't put him in the PC box, then we're gonna be here all night. I'm sure I'll remember to take him out at some point, probably. Wait, we can tell which Pokemon is which. What Pokemon is that? Oddish? So wait, I didn't have a Rattata this entire time. I had an Oddish and I just didn't, I didn't think it was an Oddish. That's bizarre. Oddish has cut. Why did I put him in the box? Access. Wait, wait, hold the, hold the phone. Did I just release Oddish? Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God.
Okay. So we have to be very, very careful right now so that we don't accidentally release Ivysaur in the PC. Okay? We gotta be very, very careful. Oh, thank Jesus Christ. I thought I... <laughs> oh! Oh my God. Fuck. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Why? Why? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Why? Great. 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 Mal, since you're back, I want to update you. You are my friend and you are my mod. So, you know how I had three Pokemon when you left? I currently have two Pokemon now because I accidentally released one of them in the PC box. Uh, so I'm fucked, but it's okay because we have a Vaporeon, a water type Pokemon, and an ice type. You know what? I'm going crazy. This is a grass type gym. I'm stupid. I'm an idiot. You're just being epic lazy, but that's okay. Epic lazy. Excuse me. I'll have you know that I just fucked myself over like an idiot. Would a lazy person do that? Only somebody as self-destructive as myself could pull that off. Nobody else. It's just me. The good news is, is that Vaporeon is extremely powerful for some reason. When Salty said impulse control, what's that? And then released Oddish, I felt that. You know what? I felt that too, chat member. I really did. My brain currently feels what sandpaper looks like. That's what my brain feels like. The image of sandpaper. Not even sandpaper, just what it looks like. Editor, please put up a picture of sandpaper. And now keyframe it so it jiggles around a little bit. Thank you. Do you not edit your own stuff? I do edit my own stuff. It's just a lot of times recently I I've needed editors to help me out. Like a lot of the stream highlights, I, I don't work on those. I work on like the bigger scripted videos now and I have like editor people help me out and work on the stream compilations. I'm a busy boy. I'm a hashtag busy boy. Well, it was nice knowing you chat. Vaporeon is Vaporeon. Guess who's gonna have to do some grinding? It's ya boy. Motherfucker, why is Cut so good? Cut should not be good. What the fuck? I'm sorry, this is- this is stupid. I think that Ivysaur is just so over-leveled for this that Ivysaur could literally just flick them and they'd go flying. Oh, I started watching the Boondocks. I'm- I'm a big fan of the Boondocks now. I'm surprised that Adult Swim had the budget to do something like that at all. Are you gonna watch the reboot of the Boondocks? Yeah, probably. On, uh, HBO Max, I think it is? Why the hell is it on HBO? Because... Why not? You know what? I have a suggestion. What? Why don't we take all of the streaming services and, and put them into like, like a package of some kind. Like a group package. So instead of subscribing to all these streaming services, you just subscribe to one collection of streaming services. Oh, we could run it through like a cable. Yeah. And we could call it like cable. Oh, I have an even better idea. We can make it cheaper if like we put a bunch of ads between shows and then more people could afford it. And sure, the ads would suck, but it would be a cheaper alternative to streaming services. Why has nobody ever thought of this? Vaporeon slowly becoming the new MVP of the song. Uh, of the song? Am I having an aneurysm tonight? I'm checking my pulse. The wrinkles in my brain are, are smoothing. I'm getting smooth brain syndrome. It's like, when, you know when you have a piece of Play-Doh in your hands and you roll it up into a ball and it's really, really smooth? That's what's happening to my brain right now. You make music? No, I don't make music, but I sing. I love singing. Are you gonna do Michael in the bathroom? Michael in the bathroom? I'm sorry, Mal, what song is that? Yes, fam famous song, top of the charts. Michael in the bathroom. I wanna see more musicals. There's just something about about a live performance of a bunch of people dancing and singing on stage that just gets me excited. It makes me want to dance and sing on stage, which I do. I've been in a whole bunch of different like really small scale musicals. I'm a theater boy. My musical dream is to somehow be in Shrek the Musical as Shrek. Like that, that is the ideal role. Here's some uh, characters that I was. The Beauty and the Beast musical. Gu guess who I played? Maurice, you will never you guess. I got Maurice. Bell's dad. Bell's dad. Could you imagine out comes Maurice, this this quote unquote old man, and I just come walking out and I'm like, haha, epic dab, and I start dabbing repeatedly, and everybody starts booing me off the stage. Salty, you gonna play Half Life 3? Ha, <laughs> nope. Gabe Newell can suck my toes. Not really sure why I said that on stream. I showed my friend the Have You Heard About Star Wars video a while back, and now he loves your content too. Oh, same, but I binged Salty's videos with my brother a while back, and now he loves Salty's vid. Oh my god, I've never heard any of this 
sort of things before from people. People binge my videos? That's fucking weird. One of my favorite YouTubers right- What the fuck? That's bizarre to me. That hurts my head. Thank- I uh, thank you. I appreciate that a lot, but holy shit, my head hurts. Damn it, everybody's just complimenting me now. Damn. I wore your shirt and someone recognized- Wait, Mal, no way. No way, somebody actually recognized it? Then I got to flex and say that we were friends, but they didn't believe me, lol. Well, believe it, motherfucker. We should say, like, a code word to, like, establish that we're, like, friends. If you go up to somebody and you say, Gringy Bingy, that's how you can communicate that you're a Salty DK Dan video watcher. But if you say, Ho Ho Ha, that's how you know that, like, you're personal mutuals with me. We're gonna have to fight against Giovanni, and I don't think that I'm ready. All right, it is H. Was not expecting him to throw that out, but I have an H on my team, and if I use H, then I think I have a fighting chance. If I'm remembering the type matchup, H isn't really super good at H, but it can H the H. Bro, what did I just do? It happened again. It happened again. I accidentally deleted one of my moves. What is this? Okay, good news is it's a water type attack. Thank fucking Christ. I gotta stop doing this. All right, let's do this. Vaporeon decimating the team. I'm sorry, not Vaporeon. H. H decimating these H's. Okay, I have nothing to worry about. My team is insanely overpowered at this point. Yeah, okay, goodbye, Giovanni. Give me the self scope. I should have, like, somebody else on voice chat when I do these streams, because what else am I gonna say about this fucking game? It's funny! They're H's! Please, please laugh. It's so funny. It's so funny that the Pokemon are H's, guys. I'm laughing. I am lolling so hard. Mal, Mal, you're here. Mal, come on call. Come on call, just like the last time I streamed this. And I started getting crazy two hours in. And what it, oh. is up, gamer? Say that again? <laughs> I said, what is up, gamer? So we're back for another harrowing game of Pokemon H. It's been like two months since I streamed Pokemon H. What, what is, um, what is something funny? Like in general or from last stream? No, just something funny. Uh, okay. Entertain um... me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wow, okay, so I have to entertain you, all right. Yeah, um, even though I'm the streamer, you're supposed what to What about me. airline food? It's pretty weird, huh? Damn shit, dude, that's relatable. I've never been on an airplane. Wait, you've never what been on an airplane? What is the deal with it? No, I've never been outside of my state. You should, you should do that. I would, if only I had money. What if you bought Krusty Burger and disguised it as your own cooking? Ho ho ho, devil, <laughs> delightfully devilish, Derek. You should go outside your own state sometime. I plan to, someday. Yeah, the world's a big place. You gotta... <laughs> You gotta go to Ohio. Ohio, specifically. Yeah. Ohio specifically. Kick down the door of some random house and say, Hi, my name is Mal. Please don't call the police. I've done that once before. Sorry, what? Don't worry about it. Alright. <laughs> Next subject. Oh, X, X, R, O, O, X uh, just subbed. And they said, Ah, I missed my favorite Pokemon. Are you sure? Was your favorite Pokemon perchance the letter H? I I'm gonna be honest here. This is the first time I've ever streamed a game and was absolutely certain that I was going to make a video about it. The only thing is, the first two streams I did of it, I had the footage and I handed it off to one of my editors, uh, Tracy. The thing is, I feel <laughs> so bad for Tracy. <laughs> the amount of work that is probably gonna have to go into cutting this monotonous shit down <laughs> is just like terrible. I feel Tracy. so bad. Okay, Tracy, if you're watching this right now, uh, say say hi. Like like, don't put text on the screen. Like record Hello. your voice oh. saying hi. Hello. Okay, now can you do a reading of a random passage from the Bible? What? Random passage. Why? You just gotta ra just randomly uh, flick uh, open a book and just hmm. put a finger down. And if you don't have a Bible, uh, write your own. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> write your own Bible passage. Okay. Uh, can I get some mood lighting, please? Thank you. <clears throat> but you, Belshazzar, his son, have not humbled yourself, though you knew all this. Instead, you have set yourself against the Lord of Heaven, 
You had the goblets from his temple brought to you, and you and your nobles, your wives and your concubines, drank wine from them. You praised the gods of silver and gold, of bronze, iron, wood, and stone, which cannot see or hear or understand. But you did not honor the god who holds in his hands your life and your ways. Therefore, he sent the hand that wrote the inscription. This is the inscription that was written. Mene, Mene, Tekel, Parson. Then at Belshazzar's command, Daniel was clothed in purple, a gold chain was placed around his neck, and he was proclaimed the third highest ruler in the kingdom. That very night, Belshazzar, king of the Babylons, was slain, and Darius the Mede took over the kingdom at the age of 62. Damn, Daniel. <laughs> okay, now, now, now that you heard that Bible passage, it's up to you, commenters. Were, were they saying a real Bible passage or a fake Bible passage? You you decide in the comments section below. See, you see, that that's a part of engaging your audience, Mal. So like, it's right a- Right now for a free iPhone 5. <laughs> please, please click here to win a free iPhone. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. But you know, it's a call to action, Mal. You, you gotta get people to subscribe by telling them to subscribe because they're stupid YouTube YouTube viewer pea brains don't understand that they can click the subscribe button to get more epic videos. Hey, uh, I just realized all these Pokemon are H's. What's up with that? <laughs> <laughs> Shit, it's been this far into the game and I just never noticed. Holy, whoa, now that you point it out, I can't believe it, you're right. Damn it. Now, now I really wish that I just streamed this and pretended like I just didn't realize that any of the characters were H's. Like whenever it like evolved, I would just know what it was. <laughs> That would be freaking epic. Damn it. Yeah, LOL XD, I gotta ask, how long did it take to make this hack? Because there actually is some decent thought that went into this. A day? Wait, you did this in a day? You know, LOL XD, I know that you were trying to make the eye Pokemon into like a really rare Pokemon, but the eye has shown up a total of like 12 times. It's not that rare. Either that or you have some really insane luck, my dude. Oh yeah, probably. Who do you think created video games? And why do you think his name is Shigeru Miyamoto? <laughs> I like to think that Shigeru was just sitting in his chair one day. He was like, I'm going to make a video game about an Italian guy who jumps really high and he eats a lot of mushrooms. That's just how it be sometimes. <laughs> I think the silence really just kind of spoke so much to me. It's like, wow. Derek, that was a really funny joke. I can totally see why you have nearly 200,000 subscribers to your YouTube channel. With humor like that, you can only get it in one place. <laughs> I mean, honestly? That's right, iFunny.com. I used to use iFunny. Listen, we all used to use iFunny. There's no shame in that, but now we know better. Indeed. Now we go to Tumblr, like sane people. Or you know what, not even Tumblr anymore. I just use Twitter for my memes. Yeah, I had to leave Tumblr because there was no more big boobies. Yeah, big boobies were not allowed on Tumblr anymore. And that made me sad. They're taking our rights away. <laughs> our right to big booby. <laughs> our right to horny. <laughs> <laughs> they took our horny right. The, the, the horny right. I'm glad I paid my iFunny Plus subscription for high quality humor and memes. That's not is real. Is that a thing? Is no, that real? There's no way. I refuse to believe that there's a subscription service for memes. Do you think that you could actually get away with that? I think so. Probably. You can get away with anything if you're rich enough. An iFunny Plus original series. iFunny, if you ever make a subscription service and you need like an iFunny Plus original, uh, hit me up. I will make content for you and it'll be exclusive to your platform. Platform, as long as you pay me. <laughs> we shall pay you two doge coins. Ah, uh, yes. The conversion rate on Bitcoin for that is really, really good. <laughs> Can Vaporeon withstand this last Pokemon? Come on, one yes! shot. Yes! Oh my god! Look at that! This this Pokemon game is insanely stable and normal. Okay, well the good news is is that I got through a lot of the plot stuff tonight so far, so that's good. That was giving me a really hard time. Salty DK Dan forgot to heal. This is an epic gamer fail. An epic gamer fail. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're going to be showing you the top ten epic gamer fails on the Salty DK Dan streaming site. No, Mal, you're putting too much emotion into it. You need to be way more monotone. Like, you 
you sound like you care, but like if you read into the voice, then you can definitely tell that you don't care. Okay. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, to watch and today we're counting down the top four times that PewDiePie swore. <laughs> number four, the PUBG bridge incident. Oh no. <laughs> and that's only number four. <laughs> you won't believe what number one is. <laughs> Is number one gonna be the fiber incident? No. <laughs> I just like the idea that, like, <laughs> you make a top 10 list and you put the best one at number 10. <laughs> it's just like, that really baits people to keep watching, but it's just like, well, what's worse than number 10? You should make your own top 10 video. I should. This is definitely gonna be a Snorlax and not the letter H. Well, God damn it! why do I even bother? Taco Bell piss nachos. The last thing you'd want on your Burger King burger is my piss. <laughs> <laughs> but that just might be what you get. <laughs> Hello, yes, uh, I would like to order the piss burger. We don't call it that anymore, we call it the Impossible Whopper now. <laughs> What's so impossible about the Whopper? I'm really curious. <laughs> No, by all means, tell tell me why it's impossible. <laughs> tell me why it's impossible it's to prepare. Like tell plants, me why. No. Tell me why it's impossible <laughs> to take a Whopper and piss on it and sell it to me. Tell me what's impossible about that. Because it goes against all the regulations. <laughs> what do you mean regulations? I don't fucking know. <laughs> I'm not a funny YouTuber like you, Derek. I can't just be funny. Yes, you can. Anybody can do it. I believe in you. <laughs> say something really funny. Say something really funny like, say like, aw, oh, dab. <laughs> be like, ha ha ha, funny dab. All Fortnite. I Fortnite. My name always is Jeff. <laughs> yeah, there we, there we go. Always default to Fortnite and my name Jeff, and you'll be fine. For me, I have my own my own custom default. I just default to Damn Daniel. And th these people, they eat it right up. It's very funny. It's hilarious. Honestly, uh, imagine me. <laughs> imagine me uh -huh. doing. I'm doing, imagining you. Yep, you're imagining me. <laughs> imagine Hello, me dude. doing stand-up comedy. Uh huh. And I just run out of things to say, so I'm just I just start talking about why Damn Daniel is really funny. It's like, so what's the deal with Damn Daniel, huh? Huh, folks? What's going on? You know? What Damn Daniel be like? <laughs> I just start quoting vines. <laughs> It's like stop! I almost dropped my croissant, and then everybody starts uh -huh. laughing. You look at you look at the audience for a second, and you like point to them, and you go, "Wow! Look at all those chickens!" <laughs> Imagine you start bombing so so hard at a comedy club that you just start you you go on YouTube on your phone, and you start playing a Vine compilation, <laughs> not even on a projector, just on your iPhone, <laughs> and you show it up to the audience. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> top 10 vines that butter my croissant. <laughs> it's like one of those vine compilations where it's just like clean vines so that my mom can watch. Yeah. <laughs> Have you guys ever seen this really funny video? It's with that one guy from 21 Jump Street. And he's at like a, an armor shipyard and he, he he's like uh, with some drug dealers and they're just like, what's this guy's name? He's like, my name's Jeff. I just, I really wish that... <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna lose my shit. Uh -huh. <laughs> I, I, I'm really hoping that we eventually discover like that there's alien life on other planets and we touch base with alien life and they have their own language, but their language just sounds like they keep saying my name Jeff over and over and over again. And it's just like a crazy coincidence. <laughs> It just, to us, sounds like they're saying my name, Jeff, but they're actually having really eloquent, long dialogues and conversations. It's like, Dude, I can probably understand them then. Bingy, no, 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 my name, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> All right, aliens, we have come to commence the peace <laughs> treaty so that your moon people do not nuke the planet. Bring it, well, no, my name Jeff. <laughs> and up there as the translator is me. <laughs> Ma Ma you're, you're the diplomat <laughs> between, <laughs> between the my name Jeffians and the human Jeffians. race. Yeah, that's their alien name, the My Name Jeffians. I communicate to them via Monster vs. Aliens keyboard solo. <laughs> that is such a specific way 
to communicate with life from another planet. You you don't you don't even play the keyboard. You you play that. I just put on one of the video. default settings. No, you play the clip from the movie. <laughs> on my phone. Yeah. I finally got through to them. The breaking point, you ask me? <laughs> I showed them a funny meme on my funny phone. So we showed the My Name Jeffians a funny meme, and they said, they said, and you can quote me on this, they said they're not going to nuke us. They say that maybe our existence has a purpose, and it's to make funny memes, deep fried <laughs> advice animals, <laughs> All of those funny memes give me the rod. I can go for a good rod. Mal, stop. I'm talking about fishing, you pervert. <laughs> I was, I'm not a pervert. <laughs> you were the one that said that. It's gross. I, yeah, but I, I, as in fishing. I want to go fishing. I'm in the mood for a rod, too. A pretzel <laughs> rod. About I dick. love pretzels. No, I'm talking about pretzels. Pretzels remind me that there is a god. I see. Yeah. Oh! My, that's not how you fish. I don't know what it is. Sometimes my head just turns around and gets stuck in my backpack when I fish. Imagine being the first person to fornicate with an alien. Imagine what your kid would look like. <laughs> Probably Imagine. really fucked up. Do you have something that you want to tell the class, Mal? Don't worry about it. What if all of my Twitch live streams, I just said like a letter at a specific time in every single Twitch live stream? Oh, uh, what if you did have an ARG? Also, let's talk about funerals. Okay. Because I got some pretty good ideas. I was gonna okay. hire a clown uh -huh. to, to read a eulogy at my funeral, and every minute of the eulogy, he has to squeak his nose. <laughs> so it'll just be like, <laughs> be like the clown saunters up <laughs> to the to the main podium. <laughs> He's like, Derek was a very good guy. Honk honk. <laughs> he told me to Father tell you all. To all. <laughs> he told me to tell you all he loves you very much and to not miss him when he's gone. Honk honk. <laughs> I wanna- I really wanna record a video before I die to be played <laughs> at my funeral, but I, I'm wondering, like, what I should do. There's you so many just, options. You should just reenact the damn Daniel fight. <laughs> but, but as, like, an old, decrypt, decrepit yeah. man. <laughs> Derek wanted this video to be shown at his funeral. Damn, Daniel! Back at it again with the white vans! It's just me in a wheelchair with white vans. <laughs> because I can't walk anymore, my legs don't work. <laughs> My my wife crying tears of joy. She's never seen a video in which I'm so happy. <laughs> but this this recreation of Damn Daniel made me feel like I was young again. I leave unto you my most prized possession, a signed pair of white vans from Damn Daniel himself. <laughs> I really wish that there was a way to get in contact with Damn Daniel. They don't have personal Twitters that they use. I'm like, where is Daniel? <laughs> Daniel, don't you know? I was wrong, I messed up, and now you're gone. Oh, Danny boy, the vans, the vans, they are calling. <laughs> can you don't? No. <laughs> Daniel has a Twitter. LawlXD, can you send that to me on Twitter, please? Danny, don't you know that you are hot as fuck on the inside? All right. Wait, his DMs are open. Bro. Oh my god. I mean, the last post he made was in 2017. I really doubt he's gonna check his DMs, but it couldn't hurt to try. You say that you are insulting DK Daniel, funny YouTuber. I want to collab. <laughs> I'm big fan. Much love. The original author of the tweet is still active, though. Josh? Wait, Josh, the guy who filmed the damn Daniel video? Wait, hold up. Hold the fuck up. I have over half as many followers as he has. Neat. Wow. Wow, wowie, wowie, zowie. You're epic. I, I am pretty epic, aren't I? Yeah. Wow. Hi, first stream. Oh, hey, Princess Explosion. This is not Welcome. a good first stream. <laughs> Sky does Minecraft. That's the funny guy who says butter. He's back to playing Minecraft again. Oh, is he? Yeah. Oh, man. The return. <laughs> the reboot we've all been waiting for. <laughs> How are you enjoying the ROM hack so far? I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? I'm wasting my fucking life on this. Hours of my life. I will never get back. And all for what? To be the one person to say that I beat this ROM hack. I was the only one to spend time to beat this extremely niche ROM hack that nobody will care about. Nobody, nobody's gonna be like, oh, that's so cool that you were the only one to beat it. They're just gonna be like, why? <laughs> <laughs> if slash when this gets turned into a video, people are gonna watch it and they're gonna be like, why? Not H. 
Why? See the wordplay I, I did right there? And when you said that, I felt it. I, I felt that. I believe that this is the fifth gym. They want a bedtime story. Okay, here's their bedtime story. Once upon a time, good night. Go the fuck to sleep. I fucking hate all of you. Die. Snore. <laughs> I would make the snoring nose noise, but my fucking nose is fucked. It doesn't work. Oh, what happened to your nose? I'm sick. Oh, okay. I'm uh, dying. Well, if you want, I can punch you in the face really hard. Dude, I would like that. I would appreciate that. Okay, I was gonna say, just say appreciate it, not like that. Nobody likes pain. Well, I mean, most people don't like pain. Mal no. What do you mean, Mal no? Mal no to what? Are you referring to Puppy Monkey Baby? Puppy Monkey Baby? Is this a thing I should know about? <laughs> Please enlighten it's me just, about- It's just an old commercial that Mountain Dew was having for the Kickstart, I think. Oh, okay. So they did a bunch of like weird commercials and one of them was a commercial of a fusion of a puppy, monkey, and a baby walking into the room and like giving a person a drink and they, they start licking their face. Huh. I have no idea. Why are you telling me no? It's already done. The deed is done. You failed. Good day, sir. I get why you would want to fuse a puppy and a baby because those are two cute things, but why the monkey? Like, I've never heard somebody say, aww, a monkey. I don't because... know. I've seen a couple people say, aww, monkey. No, I've never heard that because usually whenever I see a monkey, they're too busy flinging shit at my face <laughs> for me to say anything. <laughs> why are they flinging shit directly at your face? What'd you do to them? I don't know. I just said, haha, funny monkey, and then they got angry. <laughs> I don't know. Would you feel if someone said, haha, funny Derek? You Wouldn't know what? you also get so mad you fling shit? You know what, yeah, if I was at a convention <laughs> and somebody said, haha, funny salty, I, I, I would definitely fling my shit at them. <laughs> How dare they? <laughs> oh, God. Kill me. Okay. No, wait. <laughs> It's too late, the deed is done, the pact is sealed. <laughs> Gunshot. Gotta love the fact that I thought it was a good idea to make a poison type gym where every battle poisons you. <laughs> I love it. Good idea, game freak. You really showed me. Haha, <laughs> the Pokemon are anxious. <laughs> so, it's so funny. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh my god. <laughs> Down. <laughs> this is the time of night where everything is funny. <laughs> My fucking god. <laughs> Mal, you don't understand how funny this is. <gasps> I don't. Enlighten me. <laughs> I just, I love the letter H. You can use it to spell so many words. Mm -hmm. Like, what kind of words? Hemorrhoids. Uh huh. That's a good one. Uh, that's it. It's the only word that has the letter H in it. I see. The, the English vocabulary is, in fact, very small. Is that Mal? Yes, it's me. Yep, it's Mal, everybody. Whee! Wait, no, I changed my mind. It's not me. It's, uh, hey, <clears throat> my name's Gerber. <laughs> I'm colorblind. Holy shit, it's Gerber. Colorblind yes. as ever, I see. I can't see. <laughs> That's right, he can't see. I have to go. I have to go. Watch my favorite Minecraft beat channel. Goodbye. See you later. What's oh, hey guys, I'm back. <laughs> What's great about this is that Gerber can't defend himself because he doesn't know that we're saying this. So as long as nobody in Twitch chat ats him on Twitter, we are fine <laughs> to keep making fun of him. Hey, do it. He's gonna call me out on Twitter again. I don't care. Do it. Twitter drama gets you more followers. It's scientifically He's proven. Gonna cancel me again. I'm gonna get kicked out of the salty DK Dan family. Listen, I went to a Japanese forest and I found a dead guy and filmed it. I would know. I have so many subscribers and. Oh, dude, I was followers. there. I was the dead guy. <laughs> I was the dead guy. <laughs> I was taking a nap. That feel when you were taking a nap and Logan Paul decides to start filming you. Epic funny. You know, actually, I'm ashamed to admit, but my cousin. And I will not name him, <laughs> but my cousin was a pretty intense Logan Paul fan for oh a, a long while. I've never been more disappointed in my family. <laughs> I was like, dude, are you sure though? <laughs> are you sure? Yeah, you know, a lot of people say that there's a lot of drama at Thanksgiving. The only drama is between me and my cousin where he says that Logan Paul is the greatest YouTuber ever. And then I said, have you even watched my YouTube channel? <laughs> Have you even seen my YouTube? I made a funny anime parody. No one has ever done that on the site. <sighs> my god. Okay, you know what? I'm not even gonna heal. Let's just go into the gym leader and let's see what happens. Haha, <laughs> what if we didn't heal and fought the gym leader? Unless? Uh, unless? Alright, ninja boy. And let's see if we can one-hit KO this! 
There we go. Let's sweep the fuck out of this team. I still have three gym badges to go after this. I got Serena, the Cinnabar Island guy, and then Giovanni. And then it's the Elite Four. Holy shit, actually, that's that's only a couple of things left to do. We're almost there. Oh, wait a sec. To get Surf, don't I have to go to the Safari Zone? That's gonna suck. To the Safari Zone I go. Off we go. I'm on the road to the Safari Zone. Got my friend Mal along my way. You know what would be funny? What? If the president did a funny dab. Yeah, that would be funny. You know what would be even funnier? If he, he wasn't racist. <laughs> that yeah. would be hysterical. I would, would laugh either. so hard. Pre President <laughs> Donald Trump, hey, if you're watching this Twitch Let's Play, <laughs> you know what would be really funny is if you weren't racist. This just did. Streamer Salty DK Dad has stopped racism. Oh my god, I'm so flattered. Hey, wait a second, what if Donald Trump was the CEO of racism all along? What a twist. How does Salty know what's going on? Uh, a lot of guessing, listening to chat. No, it's because and... he's very smart. He's very big brain. Oh yeah, no, no, no. Uh, big brain. No, I, I have so many wrinkles in my scalp. I mean, my brain. On <laughs> your scalp. A wrinkly brain is a smart brain. Check your brain to see if you have any wrinkles. Just pop your head right open. Yeah, crack it open like a fucking egg. Going back in, partner. Partner. I gotta, I gotta get surf. I need to get the Cinnabar. Stat. Seriously, why the fuck would they hide a key item in the safari zone? You could very easily run out of money and just not be able to get it. That's what they want you to do. Okay, Pokemon, please stop. I need to go get Surf. Please stop <laughs> popping up. Please stop. I, I can't take this anymore. Yes. Yes. Please, give me Surf. Yes! Wait, I can teach Surf to Vaporeon too! I have a water type! <laughs> oh my god, thank you! Thank you, God! Did you know? Did you know? Did you game? <laughs> did you- did you game? <laughs> every- every episode of the Did You Game YouTube channel is just like, <laughs> Did you game? Alright, see ya! You? Cool! D did you game? Alright, we are off to Cinnabar Island! Alright, battle! <laughs> you look like Kirby in water. Yeah. I really like the surfing sprite in this game. It's very good, very good. This is currently the longest I've ever streamed this game, by the way. Four hours straight. I'm having a fun time. We like to have fun here at Salty DK Dan Incorporated. We only play the funniest games for you, for the entertainment of the viewer. Do you like funny game? Me too. It makes me chuckle. It makes me chortle. It gives me the funny hee hees. The funny hee hees, the funny ha ha's. It's incredible. Ah, ba, 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 ba. I, I literally, I'm, I'm not even joking. I've reached brain dead status mode. I can't formulate thoughts. I'm sorry to hear. It's 3.30 AM and everything is just H's. Nothing makes sense. It's like I'm living in an own self-manufactured version of hell. What a great idea, Derek. What a great idea to stream Pokemon H for five hours straight. What an excellent idea. Definitely do not take breaks. I wouldn't want you to be on your feet. Wouldn't want that to happen. Wouldn't want that to happen. Oh my god, this is not Cinnabar. Where the fuck am I? And I why is the middle stop island you have to go to to get to Cinnabar. Oh my god, yeah, you're right. Oh, there's a fucking current. I forgot. Of course there's a current. Okay, what am I doing? I'm, I'm trying to read this sign, but I know it's just gonna be H's. Why did I even bother walking over to this fucking sign? <laughs> well, I might as well read it. Oh wow, H's. Didn't realize that'd be a thing. God, this is depressing. I would love to catch Articuno right now. Just kidding. I don't care. One sec. Josh, can you stop dying over there? Sorry. <laughs> Ask Josh if, if he dies. Could I use his body for science? Derek says, if you die, can he use your body for science? Derek! Oh, sure. It's your fault now. Wait, what did you say? <laughs> what did you say? If my dead body uh -huh. starts fighting back, oops. Okay, first off, oops is not something that you would say if, if your, your corpse becomes reanimated and starts fighting me. That's the sort of thing that you say... If you accidentally spill only berries into your cereal. Oops, all berries. Not oops, oh my god, my reanimated corpse is about to strangle you to death. Just don't cut it open because it's going to smell like tacos, Lunchables, and probably Sprite. That, that I very... might be a bonus or a downside for you, but I was, shoot. I was going to say that seems like a bonus to me. Yeah, fuck interrupting you, bye. Thank you, Josh. I'm totally going to cut Josh open. <laughs> 
Okay, so here's a question. Yes. If you were filled with objects that weren't organs, what would you be filled with? Probably stacks of paper that say printer low on ink. <laughs> like, you know, some sometimes, like, the printer will, like, actually, what the fuck am I talking about? <laughs> what? Why would a printer print on a piece of paper low ink? <laughs> it wouldn't have any ink to fucking print that. God, I'm losing my mind. Like, you haven't already lost it? You're hurting my head. Very epic. I don't know you. I hope that you drown. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if you were like battling and the whole time he's like struggling to keep his head above the water? <laughs> I would love to see that. <laughs> okay, so. Oh my fucking god! How many trainers are there? God, stop! Not everybody needs to fucking fight me! God, leave me alone! Can't you see that I'm dying? It's just like Quitter. If I hear the battle theme one more time, I just- I'm gonna tear my own ears off and shove them down my throat. I love it when my enemy heals themselves during the fight. I love it. I just love like the hypocrisy when that happens. Just like you- you heal yourself whenever and then like the other person is like, cool, I can heal myself too. You're like, no, that's illegal. You can't do that. Where's the strength guy? Where- where is he? Where's the stupid H guy? I- H guy. Oh my god, the game is- the game is actually reprogramming my brain. Where is the strength guy? He's over there. Thank you, you stupid fucking <laughs> asshole. The teeth in the safari zone. What do you mean the teeth in the safari zone? Wait, I gotta go meet up with that guy again? The guy who gave me surf? Game Freak mystifies me with the, it, its early programming choices. Some people say that nowadays Pokemon is too easy. Did you- do you really want to go back to the times where you had to do fetch quests like this? It's your fucking funeral, okay? Have fun. I'd rather the game go by swiftly and easily and with more fun. I didn't mean to do that. And now I have a Pokemon. I didn't even mean to press A. And now I have a new friend. Wait a second, this isn't an H. <gasps> Fucking heresy. It says it's an H, but the sprite says otherwise. It's almost as if the creator of this ROM hack didn't think that anybody would actually take it this far. Is this it? There's no way that that was the teeth. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna follow this tutorial step by step and chat is just gonna have to deal with it. I'm sorry, I need to find these fucking teeth. I'm gonna scream. I'm gonna scream and that is okay. Do it, let it out. Ah! Damn, you need to calm down, that was too much. I'll try my best, I'm sorry. Wild Encounters got me like, <laughs> Were you <laughs> laughing at my, I just didn't expect it. The teeth have been acquired, chat, because now we got the stupid fucking teeth. Now we can give the teeth to the stupid fucking man. And the stupid fucking man can give us the stupid fucking HM that we need to get through the stupid fucking cave. And they get to stupid fucking Cinnabar Island. <laughs> of course, the new Pokemon cannot learn strength. Neither can Ivysaur. Very excellent. I'm just gonna catch something out here. I know. You see, somehow the world will change for me. It feels so wonderful. <laughs> Go, just, just get in the ball. Don't come out of the ball. Listen, I know you don't want to get in the ball, but I have an offer for you. Get in the ball. Okay, again, no, you don't want to get in the ball, but if I hit you once, you will die. So, get in the ball or perish. Okay, again, you don't seem <laughs> to be working with me here. If you get in the ball, you will be fine. I- I will say right now, you will be fine. But I'm gonna need you to get inside of the ball. See, there we go. If you can <coughs> learn this HM, then you will survive. If you cannot learn this HM, bad things will happen. Okay, bad things are gonna happen. Chat, what's a Pokemon that can learn strength? Machoke. Okay, thank you. Machoke on my balls. I'm ending the stream now. I can't right, do it okay. anymore. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> like, comment, subscribe. No, Discord do down not below. do do not do any of that, please. God, fuck, shut up. <laughs> Never. Don't watch my content. Go the fuck to bed, Derek. Go to sleep. I, I, I do out of sleep. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm dying. Uh, 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 
So in between streams, I did some grinding, and I have all the proper things in place so I can go to this gym, the next gym at Cinnabar Island, and then the final gym, and then we could go to the Elite Four. Oh, Pasty! Pasty just subscribed to the Twitch channel. Thank you, Pasty. You know, it's funny that you've subscribed. I realized that I don't know how to unsub, so even if I wanted to, which I don't, but if there's ever a point where I'm like, I need that $5, I literally cannot unsub from your Twitch. So, congratulations, I guess? I'm now a permanent customer. How come Salty never shouts me out when I resub? I feel like I'm getting scammed. Pff, no, Drum Arts. No, you're not getting scammed. Just, you know, keep resubbing and one of these days I'll acknowledge you. That's how it works. You see... <laughs> Notice me, Father. I'm noticing you. I'm utterly confused as to why there's so many H's. Oh yeah, well, well imagine me doing this for four streams. 11 hours of gameplay of this. I sometimes wonder why I do this shit. Is it because somebody's gonna laugh? Is it for my own satisfaction? I don't know anymore. I was watching a YouTube video earlier today and I saw you commented on it. That was kind of neat. What YouTube video was that? Was it something controversial and that's why you don't want to bring it up? I do, I do comment on a lot of uh, baby eating videos so maybe don't bring those up I mean what could I say I'm a man of baby eating culture instead of let's plays they they call them let's eats and uh, they eat babies Whoa, eating babies excuse me sir my eyes are up here my ass is down there but by all means please talk to the ass hey salty this is the first time I've been able to catch one of your streams oh really you enjoying yourself you like this you like this you sick freak yeah I bet you do I kid I kid I know you don't like this. <laughs> I'm looking up how to get the key card. You'd know where to get the key card if you were reading the text. Oh! Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so you're right. I should have been reading the text. Let me let me read this guy's text right now. Oh! The key card was between my ass cheeks the entire time. And I wouldn't have known it if I didn't read all that really legible text. <laughs> Not really sure exactly where I need to go, but that's okay. I'll find a way. Find a way. If you open up my thigh, see what's inside. It's a lot of fat because my thighs are fat. <laughs> How about we call the Salty DK Dan fan base the Drake and Josh army? Because we're all really big fans of Drake and Josh. The pair of kingsters. What, what did he just give me? Oh, it's Lapras. I'm gonna name you female signs and then one H. My team is already looking very good. Whoops, I forgot to save. Whoopsie daisy. Oh, well, here we go. So much for saving, forgot to do that. Whoopsies. I have watched this for three minutes and I already hate this. Try playing this for over 12 hours. Why don't you try that? Huh? Maybe that'll change your tune. Okay, let's get the master ball. I want the master ball. Give me the master ball. There we go, got the master ball. Now to heal up our Pokemon and kick Serena's ass. Or is it Selena? Probably just H H H H H H H now. God fucking damn it, what was that? Why is this possible? And why am I just so used to it at this point? I just finished a mod for Pokemon Fire Red to make it Pokemon H version. I can DM it to you. No fucking way you did. Bruh, I'm not even done with this shit yet. And you just made a remake? You didn't, oh, I don't know, put it into like a different game, like Pokemon Emerald or something? You just made the second, the game again? Why? Why would you do that? I would love if somebody could mod a 3D Pokemon game to be Pokemon H because then then they could have the 3D model of the H from that fucking gif where the H is dancing. God, I would love that. Good night, Salty. Have fun playing my hack. Good night. Fuck you. Yes. 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 Guys, we made it. What? What? Wait, where? Where's the gym leader? You need to get the key from the match. I forgot. I forgot I got to get the key from the mansion. Cool, 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 cool. Oh! <gasps> I didn't even move. I didn't even move. Bruh, I didn't even move. Please, don't, don't, please. Please. God, fuck. God, fuck, please, don't. God. Fuck. I dropped my controller. I mean, I dropped my Game Boy. My totally legitimate Game Boy. My God. I almost forget how annoying the random encounters are in this game. But it... It likes to remind me quite a lot. <laughs> quite a lot. 
quite... What is the encounter rate in here? It's like every two steps. I will suffocate myself. I will stick two drumsticks down my windpipe. Don't worry, guys. I got it. I figured it out. If I can stop battling H's for two seconds, I will be able to flip this switch and then, and only then, proceed to go down, proceed to go down here. From here, I'll be able to discover this key. I will then accidentally throw away my master ball. So the key is down here that I will be able to find the proper one. Unless that's it! If that's it, I'm gonna be really happy. B R E T key. That's not the secret key, is it? I don't know. I, I just don't know. Can you stop it? You know what I'm saying? Just stop it, you know? Come on, man. Fuck. I'm trying to live my life. God. You're really harshing my mellow. You know what? Yeah. I'm gonna use my master ball. Go, master ball. Sweet. I caught an H. I've never caught one of these before. This is a momentous occasion. I will name you... Fantastic. Hi, why do you do this to me? I hate it. Where is the secret key? Where is it? Star... Uh, uh. S-E-C-R-E-T-K-E-Y. Yep, that's the secret key. We're out of here. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I'm out. Do you have an escape rope? I think I might. Oh! Oh! Yes! Oh my god. Oh my god. It booted me back to fu- <clears throat> Why? Bruh. Bruh. What is the point? Why does it not boot you just back to the outside of the area? Why does it boot you back to the, the Pokemon Center? That makes no fucking sense. Okay, we just have to guess. I don't know how it, how to do this without knowing. Okay, <laughs> I got the correct answer. Fantastic. Okay, I'm going to say second choice on this one. Yes! Oh my god! I'm on a roll. Shit. Okay, well it was gonna happen eventually. I only got one of those wrong. You're cheating? No, I'm not. Literally, I closed the guide like 10 minutes ago. Wait, do you have burn heals? No, I don't, but I couldn't give a shit. Because I'm about to decimate Blaine's team. Fantastic. And that was the easiest gym in the entire game. Huh? That's weird. You fucking <laughs> killed me. <laughs> I'm a shitty gym leader. How do you feel about Game Freak removing the option to turn off the EXP share in Sword and Shield? Uh, I could not care less because I was gonna leave it on anyway. It literally eliminates grinding. Why would you care? Like, I know some people want more of a challenge, but like, do you want to grind? Is, is that your idea of a challenge? You could still have challenge without grinding. The only problem is, is that like, they need to adjust for that, but it apparently Sword and Shield is ins insanely easy. Hey guys, I'm gonna try to catch Missing No real quick. Ah uh, yes, Missing No. We meet at last. I don't think that that was Missing No. Okay, here we go fam. It's time. Time to go ag up against H. Okay, here it is, and it's H. Okay, well, we have a counter for that. Uh, I'm thinking if we use H on it, it, it should be super effective. Yeah, okay. Sorry, I keep mixing up the type advantages. Okay, I'm thinking we should probably use H. It, it might not one-hit KO, though. Oh, shit! Damn, almost there, almost there. Haven't even taken one hit yet. I'm thinking H for this. <sighs> Shit. I don't know why I, I- I- I just wasted H. I'm not sure why I did that. Fuck, I didn't know he had an H. I'm thinking that H would work, but like... Yeah, okay, we're good. We're good. Shit! Fuck, he has an H! Do any of my attacks even work on that? Okay, okay. Yes! Fuck yeah. Thanks, Giovanni. More like... Stupid Vani. 
fucking idiot. Chat, we did it. After around 13 hours of gameplay, four separate streams, we are almost at the Elite H, an elite squad of H trainers with extremely powerful H's. It is time, my boys. Oh, motherfucker, we forgot to beat the rival here. Oh, this is gonna be the easiest trainer battle ever. Oh my god, I'm about to beat this boy to a fucking pulp. Oh, this is gonna be really sad. And we're almost done here. Perfect. Alright, here we go. Finally here, performing for you. It's the first member of the Pokemon H crew. Oh my god, the pillars have H's on them. Oh my god, I think we finally made it. Victory Road, y'all. And I'm going to save Victory Road for another stream because I want to die. Pokemon H is probably going to take us five streams. So that's pretty crazy. All we have is Victory Road and then the Elite Four. I got spurs that jingle jangle. Hey guys, I'm late. Uh, hey, my, 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 my spurs jingle jangle too. You guys gonna let me, you guys gonna let me join in or what? My, my spurs jingle jangle too. Okay, it's not that big of a fucking deal. Everybody's spurs fucking jingle jangle. Yeah, we know, Ted. You got fucking spurs that jingle jangle. You said it 3,000 fucking times. Everybody's listening to the same song, okay? It's not like people are, uh, don't know the spurs jingle jangle. Fucking shut up. Hey guys, been a bit. You know, I say that every single time I start a stream. I'll say something different. Hey guys, it's been not a bit. I'm feeling pretty good today. So Pokemon, hey, so I never saw any of the previous streams. What is the story? Okay, so H H H H H H H H H H H H H H I hope you guys are ready for Victory Road because it's it's not fun. I'm gonna be real with y'all. I don't know what that orb is, but I'm getting it. I I crave the orb. What the fuck is going on, dude? Have you ever heard of the alphabet? You know the letter H. That's what's going on. Is it weird that I already regret booting this up? Fuck! I was just about to do the thing. I was gonna push the rock on the orb, and it was all gonna make sense. I would unlock the secrets of the universe, but this little fucking funny H showed up and ruined everything. Chat, check this out. I'm about to blow your mind, okay? I'm about to blow your mind. <coughs> that was it. Sorry for the buildup. One of my favorite new memes is the JoJo fans when they see an unsucked cock meme. Because it's relatable to me. I love sucking cock. Yo, uh, if we got fellow cocksuckers in the chat, press one. If you like sucking dick, press one. If you like slinging dick, press two. A lot of people love, love dick in this chat. Good. I would love for, like, Post Malone to have a big concert. And, like, during one of the breaks in his set, he just goes on the microphone and he's like, Hey, who here loves to suck cock? Let me hear you scream! Yo, I love sucking dick! <laughs> Yo, Leah love sucking dick! Let me hear you scream! <laughs> Who here loves slinging dick? I know some of y'all love slinging that shit. You see, gay people are like the ultimate life forms because they can not only suck dick, but they can also sling dick. And in a way, I feel like they're the peak of human evolution. Hey, chat. If you're- if anybody in this chat is gay, press 1. If you're hetero, press 2. Now mods, if you see any 2s, ban them. Get them out. I don't want to see their fucking asses in here. This stream is specifically for the gays. Nobody else, I'm sorry. I'd like to imagine that somebody is watching this stream right now that hasn't realized that they're gay yet. And by me, like, presenting this hypothetical, they're just like, you know what? I am gay. And I love watching Salty DK Dan stream. And to that one person out there, you know who you are. You're epic. Here we go. Oh. You know, I'm gonna rap to this, okay? I'm gonna rap- I'm gonna rap to this beat, okay? Nobody judge me. Pokemon! <laughs> That's it. Sorry. The amount of blatant white boy energy that I bring to this stream is- is immeasurable. Every time that I, like, showcase that I'm blatantly white, I gain another freckle on my face. I have a lot of freckles. I'm a- I'm a freckly boy. Wait, wait a second, what's happening right now? Wait, this is Moltres? Oh my god. I need to find a Pokeball. Now. Master Ball. Nope, that's not a Master Ball. <laughs> Did I use the Master Ball already? God, please tell me I didn't use it. Go, Master Ball. Sweet. 
I caught an H. I've never caught one of these before. I most definitely threw away the Master Ball. Big brain. I don't have any Pokeballs. Very glad that I ran into Moltres and I had no uh, Pokeballs. That's very cool. We have... <laughs> Killed Moltres? <laughs> well, this is awkward. Can we get some Moltres stands in here? Chat, tell me, what is your favorite Moltres moment? Ah! Uh... <laughs> this is a lot. Even for me, this is a lot. Okay, so... <sighs> it feels so punishing because I can't even figure out what I'm supposed to do. See this? What am I supposed to do about this? <sighs> okay. I cannot fuck this up. And we're good. Uh, I'm really tired. Oh, by the way, apparently there's gonna be a, a game on Steam soon called I Am Jesus Christ. I'm thinking about streaming that. Would, would you guys like it if I became Jesus for a little bit? You know how, like, Christians and Catholics, like, they believe that, like, Jesus will come again and the rapture is gonna happen. But we don't know who Jesus is gonna be. Imagine if Jesus was, like, was like me. And I'm just streaming this game, and all of a sudden I'm just like, It is time for the ascension, my followers. And then everybody just rises out of their <laughs> fucking gamer chairs. And we all just <laughs> start fucking rocketing towards the sky. And then we hit the stratosphere and fucking implode. And I don't... I don't like the idea of being dead, believe it or not. <laughs> the fuck is that? Just kidding, we already know what that is. It's uh it's an eye. Don't worry guys, it's been destroyed. No unholy letters will be shown here. You guys ever think about how video games are kind of pointless? Wait, how fast do I go? Oh <laughs> look at this boy. Woo! Salty, play a video game or I'll cry. Well, chat member, do I have the surprise for you? Take off the blindfold. Look at the screen. I am playing video game. We have officially left Victory Road, everybody. Everybody, clap. Clap for me. We did it. We are at the Elite Four. Motherfucker, I played through the entire game. I played through the entire game like this. This took over 15 hours of gameplay, but I'm here. Over 15 hours of wandering around aimlessly because I have no idea where to go. We're fucking here. Let's do it. Let's do it, gamers. Yes. Ah! Yes. Let's go. Yes. Perish. Oh, that's not good. Oh yeah, I forgot. It's an ice user. Vaporeon might not be the best pick for this. Guys, this is what Vaporeon will look like in 2020 in the animations. I don't even know what to do anymore. No! Yes! <laughs> yes! One Pokemon down, only like 27 to go. Perish, boomer! Honestly, I'm gonna run out of PP soon. Haha, <laughs> you said PP? Oh, fuck! You're right! Ah, damn it! I said PP! <laughs> Why would Pokemon name their, their move usage that? That is so random. My god. Well, I, I guess I think we all learned a little bit of a lesson today. Now, PP is funny. You <laughs> see? It is funny. Salty has achieved comedy. You fucking bet I have. We just need to get past this trainer and then we'll be fine. No, no, no! No! Ah! My feel when cringe. You know, I'm just gonna stop talking. Oh. Oh, 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 no! Come on! Go, <laughs> come on! I don't know which Pokemon this is. Whoever you are, please attack. Oh god, oh shit! <laughs> Go, other Pokemon! Please, god, fuck. <laughs> I'm getting fucking nailed. Jesus! Oh my god! I didn't prepare for this! <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh. Okay, so I got good news and bad news. Good news is, we're at the Elite Four. Bad news is, the Elite Four starts with an ice user. You have to save vibe check when you attack to ensure that you're always critical. Get ready for a vibe check, everybody. Vibe check! Everyone! Yes! Yes, it's working! Everyone, hold your hands up! Give me the power of your vibe checks! Give me your gamer energy! I'll put it into one final vibe check! Come on! Ah! Vibe check! Yes! Yes! We did it! 
We beat one trainer out of the literal five that are in the Elite Four! Even though it's called the Elite Four, there's a secret trainer at the end! If you didn't play the original Pokémon Red or Blue or the remakes, Pokémon Fire Red and Leaf Green, then I've just spoiled the ending for you, but that's okay because it doesn't really matter, this is a fucking stupid dumbass hack anyway! Oh, well, this is gonna be great. Wait, he's fighting? Oh, wait, no, that's great because I have Ice-type attacks that could totally one-shot his guys. Let's test this theory. Oh, this is gonna be so easy. <laughs> Look at this shit. Look at this dude! Look at this dude! Look at this dude! Incredible. After all of that struggle... <laughs> Vibe check. <laughs> all of the power that you've been sending my way. It's here! It's- it's finally arrived! We're vibe checking the shit out of these motherfuckers! Done. We are two trainers in, everybody. Ghost types ain't no thing. Just gonna use my water gun. <coughs> <coughs> oh my god! <coughs> oh my god! Oh, I need water! Oh, I need water! I'm turning into Kuwabara from Yu Yu Hakusho! Ruin that sheet! <coughs> use cut! Oh wait, no, it's ghost type. Don't use cut! Oh wait, no, it's not ghost type? Holy shit, Ivysaur's about to fucking beat it! <laughs> my god! No fucking way! <laughs> yes, Ivysaur! Oh my god! That feel when Ivysaur is actually fucking doing something? Holy shit. Bruh, I haven't used this Pokemon in like forever. And all of a sudden, they're- they're useful again. This is the redemption arc we've all been waiting for. Ivysaur fucking saved our asses. Ivysaur is vibe check type. Say hello to my little friend! Zero healing items, about 10 Pokemon left, half of my health, barely any moves left to use. Let's do it. Okay, we're fucked. Might need to do a little teensy bit of grinding. <laughs> yes, Lapras! No, Lapras! Yes, Lapras! No, Lapras! Yes, Lapras! Slay! Uh, That's gonna be a no for me, dog. I am, how you say, fucked? Ready for round two? Uh, uh, three? With this first Pokemon, it's a little bit of RNG because they keep fucking using rest! Sorry? Who likes grinding? I love it. Okay, grinding Q&A. If you had a Pokesona, what would it be? Hmm, that's a good question. Hmm, what what would my, my Pokesona be? Oh, a Pawnyard. The pre-evolution of uh, Bisharp. Favorite JoJo part. Part four, Diamond is Unbreakable. That part's fucking great. I want to make something that's as entertaining as JoJo part four is someday. I, w I would love to edit bumpers for Adult Swim. That would be, that would be a dream job for me. Like beyond just making something animated, I think that would be a dream for me. What is your normie job? That's a very good question, uh, but worded very badly. Like, uh, I had a job for a long time where I, I worked at a TV studio. I don't know if I'm allowed to say what TV studio it was. No, it's not Disney. I can I can say very confidently it's not Disney. That's right, guys. I worked for Pornhub. You got me. New York Pizza is kind of overhyped. Let's be real. Everybody's just like, oh, you gotta have a good old-fashioned New York Pizza. But uh, New York Pizza is greasy as shit, and it's like really bad and gross. I have never had pizza in New York City and had it be good. Pizza on the outside of New York City, but still in New York as a state is really good. Like local pizza joints. Andre from Victorious versus Sheldon from Big Bang Theory. Who who would win? It's it's Andre. What kind of fucking question is that? Andre would destroy Sheldon. Sheldon has a big brain, but he's weak and frail. Andre has like he looks like he has a little bit of meat on his bones. He could definitely kick his ass. You kidding me? Oh, you know, here's a fun thing. I had a TV production class once, and it was supposed to be about, like, making sitcoms, like how you record a sitcom. For one of our exams, we had to record an episode of Big Bang Theory. When they were casting people, they were like, okay, who wants to be Sheldon? And of course, your boy, your boy wanted to be Sheldon, so I was Sheldon on a, on a fake recording of Big Bang Theory. There, There is footage that exists somewhere on some hard drive of me on a fake set of the Big Bang Theory theory and it's it's an excerpt from an actual big bang theory episode that we recorded it was bizarre and of course the portion of the script that we had didn't have bazinga which was very upsetting i of course said bazinga anyway and yes i might have gotten points off of my grade for saying shit that wasn't on the script but at the same time Bazinga. I hope you had no laugh track. Yeah, no, we didn't. We had to take uncomfortable pauses with no laughter. It was amazing. Chat, I'm gonna need you guys to channel all of your energy right now. Here, 
we go, we are fighting. It's really difficult and shit. Please don't use rest. <laughs> oh, God, yes. If this first Pokemon wasn't that hard to beat, this run would be saved. It would be fine. I thought that this would be a fun, quick stream. Nothing crazy. Oh no, I I fell. I fell and on on the the Game Boy and it's going super fast. I think I accidentally caused the glitch. That's so weird. Sit on a fucking pencil, Lance. You fucking cock. I would have to one-shot every single Pokemon from this point forward. I don't think I can do that. Okay, please, please, please. Yes! 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 Yeah, come on! Yes! No way. Guys, holy shit. There's no way we can actually do this, right? It's time to vibe check Gary. Come on. Vibe check! Oh, uh, here it comes. Yes. Ice Beam. I'm out of Ice Beam. <laughs> well, I'm fucked. He has a full fucking team. There's no way I have enough. Acid Armor has 40 PP? We have to spam 40 PP? Are you kidding me? We're gonna be here all night. Alakazam is too powerful. We tried. Fuck. God, Vaporeon, why are you so good but so bad? This hurts to watch. Ugh. Ugh. New plan. We continuously grind until we win. <laughs> Chat. For two seconds, for two seconds, could you not talk about how Pokemon and humans used to canonically be in relationships? For two seconds, I'm asking you politely, please. I've already used half of my water gun, so what's what's even the point? This run is already dead before it even started. I'm using Ice Beam. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I hate this. Just kill me. I don't want to do this anymore. Literally kill me. Please, I don't want to play anymore. Thank you. Thank you for wasting my time, Lorelei. Thank you. I love you. God, this is the biggest waste of time in my entire life. Just a little bit more. Come on! Stop! How many potions do you have, woman? Woman, how many potions do you have? Your potions, hand them over. Do not use a potion. I swear to God. If you use a potion... <laughs> Your potions, hand them over! I'm taking everything from you! Give me your potions, hand them over! That is over half of my water guns that I now cannot use. You are good for one thing, Vaporeon, and it's using water gun. Just do it. I need to sleep. If you die, you do, you're dead to me. If you die, you're dead to me. You did! You did! You did to me! Bro, I don't care. You think I care? Think I care? Elite four, more like elite boar. Whatever. Whatever! I'm gonna be honest, this is like legitimately the most frustrated I've been on stream. Like there's no strategy to this. It's just one of those days. One of those days. Uh, hey, you're a messy. It's just one of those days. The only feasible way I can do this is if I somehow have six surfs left, which I don't, and one shot every surf. After this fight, we're gonna try the Elite Four one more time. And then I'll take like a day, train up all my Pokemon, and we'll try again in another stream. I was fairly certain that I could beat the Elite Four, but I don't think that that's happening. <laughs> Unless, you see, with the power of his gamer chat, Derek was able to overcome what seemed like an impossible task with the Elite H. But, who the fuck is doing construction outside? One shot, one shot, one shot, one shot. No! There's no way that this is happening. Unless, I disguise it as my own cooking. Come on, Leech Seed, yes! Uh... Fuck! Guys, I have an idea. This is crazy, but I have an idea. Uh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Hang on, hang on, hang on. No! Oh, it's gonna eventually run out of Hyper Beam, right? It, it's gotta. God, I'm sweating. <sighs> Battle of wills, it shall be. My Pokemon are stronger than you think. That's Hyper Beam. Oh, come on, hold it! Hold it, bud! You got this! Hold it! Yes! We can one-shot that Charizard. If we have one Surf left, then we can one-shot this Charizard in one move. I don't know if we do, but if we do, then we can one-shot this Charizard and the game will be over. Everyone, give me your energy! Raise your hands! Yes! Yes! Mm! Yes! 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 <laughs> Fire 
time check! Let's go! <sighs> yeah! The vibe has been checked. We have beaten Pokemon H. I have beaten Pokemon H. 20 hours of my life that I will never get back. I can't express to you how much time of my life is gone. I can though. About 700 hours? <laughs> wow. Professor Oak, I'm sorry. Professor H is giving our rival a little bit of a a little bit of a talk. I have never used so much strategy in Pokemon before. That that final fight, I was hanging on by a thread. Can we play Pokemon Q now? No! Shut up. Let me have this. Can can I get some H's in the chat? The Elite Four Hall of Fame, everybody. Look at all of our unique and varied Pokemon <laughs> that have been on the journey with us since the very beginning. Yes. Holy shit. Absolutely incredible. Wow. <laughs> this is like the one and only time we've seen the front sprite in the entire game. Good. Thank you, Luigi. Oh my god, I actually did it. How do I feel? I feel pretty ecstatic right now. I beat the stupid meme ROM hack. Ladies and gentlemen, the first person ever to complete Pokemon H edition. Salty DK Dan at YouTube.com. <laughs> yes! What are you going to do now? Well, die. Raid Shadow Legends. H. One final H. Is this is this a part of the thank you for playing graphic? <laughs> but it's just the H on the left. <laughs> Fitting. Fitting end to a uh, an interesting experience. Thank you so much for to playing my H. <laughs> H. <laughs> the real H was the friends we made along the way. Truly. I am currently the world record holder for Paddington Adventures in London for the 3DS. I used to be the world record holder for iCarly for Wii. Now, I am the only person to beat this ROM hack. Yeah, I'm officially a god gamer. I'm not really sure how I ended up the way I did, but I wouldn't change it anyway. You just gotta focus on the positives. You just gotta focus on, like, being you. Unapologetically. You gotta focus on improving, admitting your faults, and, uh... Just keep on chugging. Glad that I could say all this meaningful shit while Luigi is on screen. You became a rad dude. I wouldn't change my past either. Yeah, our past makes us who we are now. The good and the bad have helped form us into what we are. And the future, well, a lot of the future is still in your hands. So if you're not proud of the person you are now, you can take steps to improve yourself. All right, good night. <laughs> keep up the good stuff, guys. Love you guys. Good night. I'm too lazy to do this myself, but can somebody clip this audio and make a video version of this? Because I've been seeing this meme a lot. Here, have some chalky milk, because you're epic. Okay, just take that audio and uh, Photoshop my face onto Markiplier and put that audio in and just send it to me. Thanks.